All right, what's happening, everybody? Oh my God. Let's cut this music out. Hold on a second. Knock that shit off. There we go. There we go. What is happening, everybody? Hopefully, everybody's having a fantastic week so far. As you can see, we needed we needed a break from Batman. I was feeling a little Batman out of my fucking mind, and it, it, you know, every game is starting to it's starting to feel very repetitive. Yo, Grim, what's happening, bro? How you doing, man? But uh, yeah, Batman has been feeling a bit repetitive. As you see, we got Mr. Oopsie over here joining us on the couch right now. He's hanging out for a bit. How's it going? What's happening? But we're gonna play some Metroid Jet. Uh, bleh, bleh. The fuck was that? We're gonna play some Metroid Dread today because, uh, you know, I got this shit for Christmas, and it looks like a lot of fun. He said it's a lot of fun. I heard it's amazing. You know, so uh, I'm super excited. I played a little Metroid uh, on Nintendo. Right? We, they have the Nintendo thing going on in here. Played Metroid there. It was really, really fucking hard. Super Nintendo is one of the best ones, man. The Super Nintendo one I played, and I haven't beaten it yet, but I'm having a lot of fun with yeah. that one. And then when I heard they came out with another Metroid game, I was like, dude, this is so cool. I gotta check this one out, too. Got this one. That's what we're gonna jump into tonight, so let's uh, let's get started right now. Grim said, been better, man. Oh, that, that sucks, man. What's going on, dude? What is going on, bro? Oh, we need volume. Da, 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 da. Is that volume? That's volume. That's good. Do, 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 do. There we go. Keep the remote here. Keep the remote here. Just cause... It's because of Bob Saget, Grim. I feel like it's because of Bob Saget, right? Taking you haven't heard what happened on Sunday, did you? Is it is it Bob Saget? I heard Bob about Saget, that. Yeah. He's making heaven a better place, man. He's making he's making the angels laugh. Yes. It is sad though. He was mm -hmm. he was one of the greats. He was young, right? He was young. How old was he? You know? Had to be at least uh, late fifties, early sixties. Late? Yeah, I'm gonna say late fifties, right? Yeah, I don't even know what happened to him. I think he might have had a heart attack or something. I'm assuming it was a heart attack. I have no idea. Yeah, Grim says, yeah, that's uh, that's what's going. Yeah, dude, it sucks, man. It sucks. You know they say like deaths always come in threes. Yeah. And it was Madden, Betty White, Bob Saget. Now. I think Betty White made me more upset than anything. Dude, I can't believe Betty White. She was she was gonna be a hundred, dude. I know, man. And they they jinxed her too, cause they put that in all the magazines. She's about to turn a hundred years old, and then all of a you're sudden right, she's you're dead. Right, you're right. You're right. They did kind of jinx that shit. But dude, ninety yo, living in ninety nine. That's you live. You live the life. I right wish there. I could live to a hundred. Dude, and she and she looked. She like you know she fucking she, she looked aged good. good, man. She aged good. Yeah, she aged good. Adjust the brightness until the image on the left is barely visible. The brightness can be adjusted at any time during the gameplay. Well, I'm practically fucking blind as it is, so everything's barely visible to me. <laughs> Very true. Would you like to save these settings? No data. So I heard the reason why a lot of people love this game is because it reminds them of the Metroidvania type gameplay. Oh, hold on a second. We got let's we got a little light right light right re reading here. Metroid, virulent. The hell is that word? Virulent. 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 Maybe it's virulent. We're both, we're you don't both, know. We're, you don't, we're, know, we're know, either. don't know how to read. You so. don't know. What it, a virulent floating organism that drained energy from its prey through physical contact. Metroids were originally created by the Ch Chozo and named after their word for ultimate warrior. Their value as a bioweapon sparked several crises, crises, and as a result, all traces of them have been eliminated. They are now extinct. Oh shit. Metroids are extinct. That's rough. That's rough, dude. That ain't right. That ain't right. Uh. Excuse me. So then what the hell am I going to fight? Or are they? 
Nah, they we, gotta. We don't know. We don't know. We, we don't, don't know. know. We'll figure it out, though, dude. It's gelatinous. I know that word. Gelat. Uh, an ex parasite. A gelatinous parasitic organism indigenous to the planet SR388. It can absorb the DNA of its host, living or dead, and replicate its form. When infecting a living host, it could even access the host's memories. Ex parasites were driven. Not by emotion, but by an instinctive need to replicate and spread to increasingly stronger hosts. Their inability to be controlled marked them as even more dangerous than their sole predator, the Metroids. Like the Metroids, they are believed extinct. Hey, look, there we are. I got shot with a blob. That's a Metroid. No, it's not. I feel like it was a Metroid. They look like jellyfish. I know they look like jellyfish. That doesn't look like a new Metroid. Oh, yeah, but no Metroid surviving on SR388, it became infested with the X, horrifying parasites capable of imitating any living being. Unaware of this, I set foot on the planet, got infected, and almost died. Well, we're off to a good start. Yeah. I don't know where this. I don't know when this game takes place after. Our suit's different. I just remember Metroid Other M. I don't know if this takes place after that or not. I'm so new to the Metroid gaming like world. Yeah, I can't tell you what this is a sequel to. This might be a whole new game. I have no idea. I'm f I'm excited for this. I'm excited for this. The only thing that saved me was a vaccine created from Metroid DNA, which also left me uniquely able to oppose the X. This ability was tested immediately when I went to a biologic space laboratories BSL for sure for sure research station to investigate a, dist a distress signal man I can't read for shit tonight is that me yeah that's Samus there I battled many powerful X forms including the SAX the sax which was the X mimicking me in my power suit at full strength I eventually eliminated the X-Menace on SR388 by setting the BSL research station on a collision course with the planet. It's pretty wild. So we got Grim over here saying, Virulence is a pathogen or a microorganism's ability to cause damage to a host. In most contexts, especially in animal systems, virulence refers uh, to the degree of damage caused by a microbe to its host. The pathogenicity of an organism. I said that good said that good. Its ability to cause disease is determined by its violence factors. Oh shit, Grim. Grim dropping some 411 in the chat. Alright, man. Cluing us in. I appreciate that, dude. Let's drop some knowledge. There I battle... Oh, I already read this, didn't I? Yeah, you did. I did. I, you know, you're right. You're right. You know, I so, saw... So, before we read any further, you see these penis right here? These are the deluxe, and they have cashews, almonds, Brazil nuts, pecans, and pistachios. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I mixed them with, like, the regular peanuts. You know what they're trying to say now? They're trying to say that cashews are not good for you. Protein. No, I know, but they're literally saying, the science is saying that, pro that cashews are literally not good for you. You know, anything in abundance is not good for you. Well, that's true, yeah. If you eat too much... Uh, if I drink too much water during the day, I'm overhydrating. Yeah. That's bad. For you. Saturated fats, uh, too many of saturated fats is not good for you. But, but what bothered me is I was like, oh my god, get some peanuts, right? And I know I just decided to break into peanuts in the middle of us reading this um, amazing content. But I couldn't believe this and call me an old man or whatever. But I got these on sale during December, yeah. and I saw they had them again. It's pretty cool that they mix everything like that. Dude, $11 for a can. Yeah, I've never seen that before. That's actually pretty... That must be new. That must be like a new thing, because I've never seen them mix... Pistachios and Yeah, shit. I've never seen them do that. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to end up getting them again, because they are really good. I, I always love the pistachio kernels. I hate having to break them out of the shells, so I yeah. always buy the ones where, like, they don't have any shells. They're already picked for you. Exactly. Yeah. But that, that, that that's like an extra $5. Yeah, I know. I know. Shells. It sucks. I, I spent a lot of money having to get those... Back to the reading. After that, the X and Metroids were just memories, or so we thought. Just when all 
Just when it all seemed over, the Galactic Federation received a mysterious video transmission. <laughs> Grim wants to know, what is beer beans in the point rewards? So, uh, beer beans. really quick, we got, I got these for Christmas. We got Jelly Belly Draft Beer Jelly Beans. They're supposed to taste like beer. I don't know if they're all different beers and stuff, but I thought it would be cool just to add it as just a, you know just a dumb tap channel tree. Just just a thing. It's a thing. <laughs> but yeah, we could try them out. Yo, JD, what's happening? What's up, old man? That ain't right, man. That ain't right, JD. You're right, though. You're right. How's it been, dude? How you been? How's everything going? How fucking cold is it in Canada right now? Because what is it, like 13 degrees outside right now? Yeah, it's pretty bad outside. So Canada's probably below zero. Yeah. I think I think they go Celsius, too. I don't think they do Fahrenheit. Now, how hot does it get in the summer there, J.D.? What is it, like, six... What do you guys get, like, 70 degrees, maybe? Does it get any hotter than that? I know it doesn't get too hot in Canada. That's our video transmission. It showed an X alive in the wild. I don't know, dude. What do you think? What do you guys think? Like, how, how do you feel? I mean, is this like a red game? I was trying to figure out the color to keep the room. Uh, I kind of like the blue because it lights the room up a lot. It makes it easier to see. I think the I think the blue is good for any anything. Anything. The, the, the red is literally, I feel like I'm, I'm in a emergency exit or something. It's super dark. I yeah. feel like we're in like an alien's movie. Yeah, like we're gonna like we're gonna die at any minute. Yeah. Yeah, I don't you uh wrote so to me before you continue. Yeah. I don't yeah, want yeah. to bother you while you're playing, so No no dude, it's fine. When you need one just let me know. Let me know bro. Let's see, I'll stick to beer stray. Thank you very much, says Grim. Dude I still couldn't figure out how to open this damn can. It's like a... I think it's got, like, tape around... Oh, it does. It's like a Harry Potter treat, bro. I want to see what they smell like, though. JD says, I'm good. It's be uh, down to negative 42 degrees Fahrenheit oh, in the wind. Oh, my God. Ugh. Can't you, like, die holy from that? If you... if you stay out there long enough. Yeah, well, holy shit, man. That's... Fucking crazy. JD redeeming the beer beans. Using them channel treats. Oh my god. Let's go back to the other screen. We're just gonna keep jumping back and forth. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It's got the tape. Now, JD, I'm really hoping that is it. Remember, like, we, we were do I was doing a show once. JD remembers this. Me and, me and Papa K were doing a show. Yeah. And he bought. Like the fucking the really cheap peanuts. Like he goes, dude, I found these. They were like a nickel. I remember because I was I was over there and he I saw him bring them over to you. The true value were they the true value ones? They were, dude. They were, they were dude, worse. They were, they were value, worse. Right? They were worse than that. Yeah, and I remember we were doing a sports cast and I ate some and it tasted like like potpourri. Oh god. I hope that these don't taste like potpourri. Oh. Which, by the way, we're not sponsored by Jelly Belly in any way shape or form this was an awesome christmas gift from my mother-in-law and i'm kind of excited about this jd saying yeah frostbite sets in in just a few minutes where he's uh, at yeah it, it got that cold here in new york uh last year or two years ago it hits it hits some pretty i don't think yeah. we've ever had negative 42 though in it the got close to it I, it I think negative 27 was like the lowest yeah and i remember they were saying if you stayed out there any longer than an hour you would get fucking Crossfire or some shit, but oh, dude. I didn't go into work that night. Dude, check this out, guys. This is it comes in like separate packages. So that's gotta mean different flavors, right? This is pretty cool. You wanna try one? Yeah, sure. Uh -huh. I'll share I'll share the rewards. I'll try it. I feel like we're taking drugs or something right now. That's <laughs> jelly beans! Bags are in. Jesus. <laughs> it's right though. Like, look at this shit. Tell them take it, LSD. What's it's going like, on? It's like a dime bag of weed or some shit. 
Uh oh. Well, that one's gone forever. I see it. Go get it. Can you get that, please? I didn't mean to say it, like, go get it. Alright, right, hold on. I don't really care. Huh. Well, it... I'm not eating that one. It was on the floor. Good five second roll. I don't care. He just went for it. They're actually really good. It's like root beer. They're really good. I like them. Yo! Right? It's like root beer. Yo, that's really good. And that's this one. Sure it's not root beer? It might be root no, beer. No, it says it. draft beer. No, I, I know it says draft beer, but I'm saying maybe that one was a root beer one or something. I don't know, it's pretty good. I I'm not it. upset about it. It's got a nice taste to it. Yo, I definitely recommend these so far. And yeah, it looks like we got like lagers, pilsners, IPAs and shit in here. Oh wow, well, I don't want the IPA ones. I don't like IPAs. They they taste like they taste like the smell of cat piss. <laughs> well, let's let me just empty these in here. We'll just empty those in there. And then uh, if we redeem any more, we could open a new bag, try out the new ones. Yeah, definitely. And then empty these in here. Those are yummy. Dude, I definitely order this shit again. I wonder if I could get Papa K to try one of these. We will find out tomorrow. Thursday. Oh, tomorrow's Wednesday. That's yeah. Right. Today's Tuesday. Today's I'm Tipsy Tuesday. I'm always off, dude. I'm Sunday, Monday off. <laughs> always off. I think today's Monday, that's why. See, uh, only JD saying, uh, uh, got an IPA one in there? Dude, some of them are darker than others. I'm willing to bet that there's, like, probably a stout. I'm willing to bet they go down all the major ones. Like, there's probably a lager. There's probably a pilsner. Probably a stout, an IPA. Yeah, definitely an IPA. Although I don't know why anybody would want to have that. Dude, IPA. I like IPAs. I can't. Dude, they're so nasty. They Dude, you, so you, maybe you're not getting the right ones. You gotta no, try dogfish. They, they all taste. They all taste the same to me. Mm -mm. They all taste mm -mm. like the smell of cat piss. You know what cat piss tastes like. No, I said they taste like the smell of cat piss. I don't think that makes any sense, dude. Smell and taste? Does it make sense? Does it make, did it make sense what he just said to you? It pretty much makes sense, yeah. It tastes like the smell, so then you can taste smell? No, so like you smell like you smell something, right? And you're like, oh and man. And then you can like, taste the smell? You're like, I, that bit? smells like cat piss. And then you taste it, and then you're like... And it tastes like cat piss. Like the smell of it. I think you need to stop drinking. Dude. I'm just telling you. I'm, <laughs> I'm just telling you. It makes sense to me. It makes sense to me. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. It makes sense to me. We got Grim over here saying, did you see the Vikings general manager and coach got fired? Dude, Grim, I can't wait for Thursday because between that... Giants fired Joe Judge today, I heard. Oh, wow. Yup, he's Holy gone. Shit. Gettleman, the GM, retired because he probably knew he was getting canned. Oh, Yo, Thursday is going to be... We got a lot to talk we got about. got some changes, man. We got a lot to talk about on Thursday. And we got... We're going to go over Pop's picks and uh, how everybody did for the regular season. I think, actually, I think Papa K beat me. I, I, I can't... I can't buy a win right now. I can't win in fantasy football. I couldn't win in home run derby. I couldn't beat him in pops picks. I Hopefully, got, I got in third. He got. He did get third place over here. This is here, my third me. year in a row that I've gotten in the finals. And actually, we are we are opening up room because JD's going to join us next season. Nice, nice. So we, I, we're making. We're already making moves, JD. I, I beat Swift for third place. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually happy about that because Swift always beats the crap out of us every year. Mm -hmm. She's not an easy one to take down. But, um, and I barely beat her, too. But then we're going to have Pop's playoff pick starting this Thursday as well. Because this, this, this weekend is going to be a lot. Six yeah, a lot playoff games. Go, oh, yeah. we got a lot going on. Though. I'm excited. How about them Buffalo Bills? Yeah, they're in it. They're in it. They're in it. We got Jay game, says, man. it makes sense. I say that all the time. Smell and taste are directly related. I get that. I get that. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> 
Thank you. Don't side with him, JD. Don't side with him. Don't 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 give him a fat head. It's already big enough, all right? <laughs> Thorough analysis uh, proved the video was real. Although the sender was unknown, the transmission was traced to a particular planet. Dude, the graphics in this shit is awesome. It's a lot of reading. <laughs> I like the lore. I, I like the lore. I do too, but I'm just saying I'm not used to it anymore. I've been, like, it was all the text stuff. Well, you know what, though? I kind of like the reading more. Like, when, when you play games like Metal Gear Solid, there's so many cutscenes. Oh, that, I, love like, you, I love I love it. the cutscenes, but, like, yeah. when you're streaming yeah. and you want to, like, talk to chat or talk about something or just, just bring up a point, like, I feel like I'm always interrupting it's, a cutscene. It's not even that. It's like when this I... This I could take my, you know, do my thing. Yeah, it's, well, it's like when you play Resident Evil games, it's, right? They still I talk have too much. texting and notes and everything like that. I love reading that shit. Yeah. Like, without a doubt... Let's see, we got uh, Maniac first time. Buy followers and viewers on Goodbye. Thank you, JD, for taking care of that, man. I appreciate that. I've been meaning to thank you. According to Twitch, you have earned the most channel points in my chat this uh, this last year. I got the most. I got the most from from 2021. For, uh, for JD? For JD's channel, yeah. J Jay's got some really cool channel points, too. Like, uh... He, he puts, uh, he's got um, Cards Against Humanity on there. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's just some, so he's picked out some funny shit, yeah, dude, in cool. the past. That's cool. Mm -hmm. I haven't played that game in God knows how long. Dude. Between that, that, JD's got Cards Against Humanity. Goonie B's got I Descent. I don't, think, I don't think I played that, the I Descent. Oh, it's a, it's a debate. It's, it's a debate game. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, he'll say something like Christmas Tree, real or fake. And then you got to make the argument on like I like fake because it is this and it's oh, just, that's pretty cool. It turn, yeah, yeah. A, lot of, a lot of cool channel channel rewards. It was called ZDR. If the X had somehow escaped extinction out there, they would pose a threat to the entire galaxy. The Galactic Federation dispatched a research team of seven EMMI to investigate. What the hell's an EMMI? An Emmy? I, I you got an Emmy. I'm so out of touch with Metroid. I couldn't tell you what an EMMI is. So you have to ask Grim, the the what the, this the, is? the Wikipedia guy. He's yeah. he's he's our four one one. Yes, the four one one guy. You're gonna have to ask him what an EMMI is in, in Metroid because I don't remember. Oh damn! And Grim saying the, uh, the Vikings hit the shit out of the Bears on Sunday, thirty one to seventeen. Dude, I'm telling you. I kind of saw that coming though. Dude, I, I I you know the Bears. I mean. You know, I say it every time we bring the Vikings up. I said it in the beginning of the season. Yeah. I had a gut feeling. I was right. They're just a couple pieces away from taking that division over. Yeah. I mean, I'm just, I'm, you know. It, you see, they're going down the right path. They are. They're going they down are. the right path. That's freaking badass, though, man. Congrats on the Vikings beating up the bear. Although, I'm sure Swift ain't too excited about Probably that. Not. Probably not. Uh, JD's saying, oh, I need a debate game. Dude, that... Check out that I Descent game, man. Okay, that is... What is that? That is not... That is the thing that's gonna uh, haunt you for the rest of the game. Is that an Emmy? Uh, Dude, I just... Oh, uh, it is an Emmy. Okay, all right, it's an <laughs> Emmy. All right, it sounds like an enema. I mean, I'm, I'm just... It's the thing came out of his face, it's, dude. It's like a shortcut for an enema. Dude. Um, <laughs> that's what it sounds like. I'm gonna give you an Emmy. Or, 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 or an award. Well, with the I mean, thing I mean, coming out of his face, look at bro. it that way, too. Give him an award or something. I don't know, but it just sounds like short for an animal to me. We need to play Gartic Phone um, still someday. Dude, I'm down for it, you know? You you, you were, you organize it, JD? You get, you get everybody together? I think I know how to set it up, too, now. I think I can actually get it going on stream. Jay Swift showed me something really cool I could do. With I, I didn't know you could create separate windows. Using the same thing. Like, if I pull this shit down from the tab bar, it opens its own window for it. And oh, then yeah. I can capture certain windows. That's that's what a lot of people do with a, with a single monitor, I guess. Yeah, I, I did not realize yeah, that I could do I'm that. Not, and not, she showed me that. I felt I'm, like such a an idiot. Honestly, dude, I'm not a computer guy anymore. I haven't owned a computer since 2005. So I, 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 I used yeah. to be a PC guy. I, am, I do not know anything about PCs anymore. But yo, Garthic Phone, you yo, you, we gotta get you involved in that too. And what? 
Karthik film. I'll show it to you later on. It's like I don't want to, want to go down a whole ring of mo- roll of explaining yeah, it. But yeah, yeah, no, no, no. We'll do it off stream. That's fine. Do it off stream. I'll show it to you on YouTube. It's uh, they, there's some funny videos, man. Yeah, Looks no, like a fun game. Check it out. I looked that up. It just uh, directs me to Metroid stuff. It says Grim. All right, so we got the Emmy. I'm, I'm pretty sure the Emmy is the uh, the stalker that follows you throughout the entire game that tries to kill you. Have you played this yet? No, but I saw videos on it, and I know and I know some things. I'm not going to give it away, obviously. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. But I know... No spoilers. No, no spoilers, but I'm pretty sure that's a robot that's trying to kill you. Cool. Cool. Well, listen, we've survived Nemesis. We've survived the Tyrant. Yeah. We've survived Mr. X. I ain't worried about this guy. He's got skinny legs. An Emmy is a large researcher <laughs> robot designed to capture field samples and extract the DNA. Their incredible mobility and protective plating made of the strongest stuff in the universe practically guaranteed the mission's success. Oh, so they're our friends. I have no idea. No, he's I'm, just I'm, lying to me. I'm lost at this point. I don't Dude, know. doesn't it kind of feel like GDQ right now when we're not playing fast at all? We got freaking... We got Mr. Oopsie on the couch. And I'm just taking my sweet ass time. Wait, I, okay, so Grim says he knows what it means. All right, all right. All righty, all righty. But not long after their arrival on ZDR, all communication was lost. Is it short for an enema? I'm gonna say every man made ice. Man made ice? Every man made ice. Well, what do you think it stands for? Uh, I know I was way the fuck off, but like, if you got something, throw it out there. E M M I. Do it. Ow. What Every, is everyone might make Instagram? I mean, you go that far, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I mean, I was I, I was trying to come up with something clever, but I don't know what to say with the eyes. So, every man might ice cream. Every man might make ice cream. That's three M's. Okay, so every everyone may everyone might make ice cream. Okay, I like that one better. That one's good. What is happening on ZDR? Is the planet really infested with X? As the only one immune to the parasites, it's up to me to go there and find out. Yo, we got Broski in the chat. UZF should stream Zombie Army 4. Is that Pops? Who is that? Yo, we got Mr. Oopsie joining us in the background over here. I offered him Papa K's chair, but he said he couldn't touch the king's chair, you know? No, I'm good in the couch, man. Good on the couch. He's chilling. He's chilling out right now. Oh, we're getting into the game now. But what's happening, Broski? How you doing, man? What's up, Shun? You know, I'm disappointed in you, man. I wanted you to win. He almost had it. He almost had it. GG's, though. GG's, Broski. Yeah, we could do a Zombie Army 4. Zombie Army Trilogy 4. Yeah, I think Grim. Grim, you still have that, right? You have that, I think. We're just setting all sorts of future plans up for streams. See, look at how cool this shit looks. I'm digging the graphics right now. They're pretty. Broski says, the Raiders. <laughs> Come on, man. That's how I won. That's how I won. He needed the Raiders. That's how he took third place. Yeah. Overtime, baby. Dude, and that was the one time Swift got like confident and cocky. I know. She, and she was, was like, I got this game. She but she so never says overtime. that. She never yeah. says that. And the one time she said it, she jinxed herself. That's what Sean did to me. He literally, one guy, one guy, he was like, well, I guess it's over. And I went, look again. It ain't it's over. It's not over. Is that me? That's not me. That's me. That is you. What's wrong with my suit? My suit uh, looks different. Uh, I think you, um, you fused with something. 
and knock the paint off. If I, if I remember the story correctly, I think you fused with a Metroid or something, and that's why your suit looks like that. I don't know. I could be wrong. That's a cool looking place. I like the art style, though. It's nice. It is. It is pretty, pretty good. graphics. Well, there, there's, there's other suits. That's the uh, original suit. Classic there's a lot of cutscenes in this game. Dude, we got a lot going on. Oh, hey. I'm so confused right now. Okay, Grim's over here. Hold on. You know what? Let's get through this cutscene. I'm going to catch up with you, chat. Yeah, it's literally taken us 20 minutes just to get to... I, I, we haven't even started the gameplay yet. Which, I'm okay with that, but there is a lot going on. I gotta, I, is this how I start the game? I gotta fight this that, thing? Who the hell is that? Who is that? I don't know, but whatever I'm doing to it, I'm not doing anything to it. Uh oh. Is that Enema? I don't know what is happening. What is that Parasite X? I shoot a rock, but I do. Ooh, I cracked his helmet. Uh oh. I have no idea what's going on. It's a bird. Uh oh. It might be from a different game, maybe? Like they're showing what. I think it's about to blow my face off. Uh oh. Mother of God, he cracked her out. Am I dead? Something oh, happened. See, now we're, okay, so now her suit's different. Did that change, did that to me? Did he change her suit? Or, I, I don't know what's. Yeah, I guess he did. He we don't know if it's a he. Could be a she. Could Who be a she. Could be whatever. Oh, you're finally getting to play. Look at that. How's it feel? Does it feel nice? <laughs> it does feel pretty cool. Man, I'm loving this art style. Dude, we gotta see, we gotta check this plate out and see if they have any of these, uh, these, you, you, you heard of this plate? Yeah, I have. The metal posters? See yeah, if they yeah, got yeah. any of those. Let's see. Style of this. So Grim over here says the EMMI robots that stalk and threaten Samus at several points across the game managed to flip the script with Galaxy's uh, bounty hunter, a nearly helpless prey. It's basically Mr. X in Metroid form. <laughs> Broski coming in saying, uh, F Bill Belichick, he blew it for me. Um, the um, Fredfro scores you win. I don't know if you saw the play item, but they said that Renfro foot uh, was touched. Not as cool as uh, Zombie Army 4. Contra is a better horizontal game. I, I actually... Broski, did, Broski, I'm feeling like you're... Uh, I actually did see that play, Sean. I did. What is this? But all I gotta say is Renfro is a beast. Oh, dude, this is super cool. Oh! How do I, uh... Oh, I can aim. And I'm very, uh, disappointed in Derek Carr. He has literally let me down pretty much the whole season. And I don't know why I didn't put Russell Wilson in. <laughs> you got Jay Swift yelling in the background. Ooh, I got a rocket. Carr's a good quarterback, though. He just yeah. didn't have a good season at all. L he was he was very. My entire team was very hit and miss. It was very um, unpredictable. They 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 were all over the place. One minute they get millions of points. Next minute they wouldn't get any shit. You know. Mm -hmm. That's why it was always hard for me to predict who to put on the field or in, on my on my thing and on my bench. Dude, it was a, it was a, it was an epic season. I went nine and seven. This is one of the best seasons I've had in a while. Let's see. All right, boys, have fun. I got to play with the uh, poopy. It's what I do. All right, broski, have a great night, man. Later, Sean. Okay. Let's 
Got to time this right, everybody. Oh, yeah, look at that. Like a pro. Who's that? Oh, man, this is... It looks awesome. I think I might have to buy this shit. You should. I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell you right now. Oopsie, do it. Oh, I got to shoot that with a rocket. What is this? I'll tell you. I, lo I loved Metroid Other M. Ammo already at max. Okay, so we got... These are ammo stations. Um, I know what I gotta do here. I like R. The, I like the old school feel to it. I like. I like how. I love this. It reminds me of Super Metroid. It really yeah. does. I, li I like that they brought the whole Metroidvania style back. Where like you gotta keep going back and forth to you know, and you need to get power ups to get to the hidden areas and shit. And try shooting at your surroundings. Striking some blocks with missiles may reveal how to destroy them. So it wants me to use missiles? Yeah. Yeah. You gotta break the wall for the missile. So how do I get past that? You gotta break the wall of the missile. Yeah, but that's not that's a missile. Keep hitting it. With more missiles? Yeah. No, I'm just wasting missiles. Alright, so wait, then do the Hold oh, on, let's get more missiles. Block. There you go. Let's get more missiles. Bah! How'd you know that did that? Because I'm reading the the stuff. Go to the left side. What's over on the left side? Look, you can get underneath it. You can get under there. No? I, I don't think that's right. It's a facade. It's a facade! Alright, so I we know that block is back. It's alright, it's alright. How'd that happen though? Because it keeps spawning. Oh, you mean. Okay. Oh, alright. Some, Some destructive, destructive blocks, blocks are hidden. Are I took care of it. Shoot the door. <laughs> Ooh, cutscene! I'm really liking the feel of this so far. I think I remember seeing this far in. Good luck. What the fuck does that mean? I can't have a boss fight already. I've been learning how to play the game. So long to access the network station. Well done, Samus. I have reviewed your vital signs and video log from the data you uploaded. Oh, I've I run a full analysis. Name's Adam. But I cannot account for why you lost consciousness. My readings indicate dramatic physical changes in you. I like his voice. I have dramatic physical changes Whatever in you. Whatever caused these changes seems yeah, to have certain of most abilities. You might call it physical amnesia. I'm going through changes. This is what they always do in every match. Like they strip you of your abilities, and then you gotta run around the entire map and try to get everything back. Find them. I think at some point I do want to stream the original match. Um, um, I want to stream oh, Super to. Metroid. Super Metroid. You have to, man. There's a speed run on that, too. I saw it. I saw the GDQ. I, oh, I forgot who did it, but it was awesome. I think it was Oats and Goats. Yeah, it was Oats speed, and Goats. Yeah, it was awesome. speed run on that, too. That shit is... You can beat that game in, like, what, under an hour or some shit like that? Oh, by the way, guys, check out my awesome-ass controller. How badass is that? Got this for Christmas, too. What is it? My controller. Oh, yeah, I love that controller. That brings me uh, to your assailant. I am checking the Federation database against your video log. It appears to have been a chozo. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. I have determined that you are somewhere within the depths of CTR. Your top priority should be to return to your ship on the surface. This situation is precarious. Trust your instincts as you navigate upward. Trust my instincts, all right. This planet appears to consist of multiple areas. Shuttles, elevators, and other modes of transport connect up. Keep an eye out for ways to reach the surface. The ship's location is marked on your global map. Check it for yourself. Okay. You may encounter pockets of low temperature. Your Metroid DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments. Spending time in cold areas will be harmful to you. There are many such cold areas scattered underground. Do not enter them with your basic power suit. Okay. One final thing. Underground interference is preventing radio transmissions. Check in with me at any network stations you find. Okay, so this is like, this is my go-to guy right here. To save my prog my progress, I will definitely do that. 
Alright, press plus to open the map. Whoa, 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 whoa. Press button minus to open the options. Options. Plus. Okay, we got the map. Ah, oh, this is great. This is great. Well, see, that moment you grow up thinking Samus is a guy, but years later you discover Samus is a woman. She's a woman, Grim. So when I first, yeah, when I first saw her in... In Super Smash Brothers for 64. I was like, oh, I'm going to pick that dude. And I forgot who I was playing with. They're like, that's not a dude. I was like, what? You find out, yet, like you said, Grim. She's a woman. Probably one of the... Oh, oh. I take care of this guy. Or whatever it is. So I can't, I gotta be careful with the cold. Oh! It feels weird, I'm not gonna lie, chat. It feels weird using the joystick and not being able to use the D-pad to run around. Uh, that's bad. Use a melee counter at the right moment to parry certain attacks and automatically take aim at the attacker, press X to use your melee counter now. Oh! Parry enemy attacks with melee counter, press X at the right moment. That was cool. Can I aim in there? Okay, that's pretty dope. Yeah, same here. I love playing Smash on 64. Dude, that... That game was just so badass. Oh! That's what you get. That's what you get. this timing. Getting better with it. Getting better with it. I'm feeling good about it. Dude, what was your favorite character uh, for Smash Brothers on 64? Like, who was your go-to, Grim? See what your main was. Oh, dude, this counter... Dude, this counter shit is awesome. I learned how to counter enemies' attacks and shoot them in the face. Uh oh. Artaria. If an area on the map is blinking, it indicates that a hidden item is there. That's good to know. What about you? We were just talking about, because Grim had mentioned in chat, he was like, you know. Growing up as a kid, you sit there your whole time thinking that Samus is a guy, and then as you get older, you learn she's a woman. Well, actually, actually, at the end of the first Nintendo game, I beat the Nintendo game, the original. Oh, yeah? You find out Samus is a girl at the end of the game. You did, but they don't lead but anything you, to that. They don't. They don't at all. Like, you think it is a guy the entire time, but I guess, I guess that would be considered sexist. Because <laughs> everybody, well, back then, like... You know, most um, most heroes were male. They didn't put a lot yeah, of females. Yeah, think in about it. when these games came out. Like we're talking eighties, yeah, right? Eighties, so nineties. Over thirty something years ago, thirty plus years ago. I think. I think actually, I think Metroid's older than me. It might have came out in eighty six or eighty nine. Between eighty six and eighty nine, I think. Yo, Grim. Grim, can you look that up, dude? And you're saying, okay? So I was asking Grim. I was like, because I mentioned, I was like. First time I was introduced to Samus was Super Smash Brothers on the 64. Yeah, yeah. And One of the uh, best characters in Smash Brothers. So I was asking, I was like, what was like, what's what was Grimm's favorite? What was your favorite character? My favorite was Link. 
Link, you were I was Link a play? cheap son of a bitch, dude. You were Link. I would he do says he was. Uh, Grim says he was Samus. I would do the 360 sword on everybody, knock them off the map, and then I would just grab them with the, the grapple hook and just kick them off and keep doing it until they they, they could never get back on the map. See, I would, they hated like my friends hated me when I played that game. I was a Kirby. I play, I, oh, I, Kirby I, was annoying. I, 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 I was, was so I annoying. was the guy that would fly above. Yeah. Like, even if you kicked him, me off, him, I would fly above you and do that brick thing him, to you. Him and Jigglypuff, they were a pain Jigglypuff. in the ass. Jigglypuff. They were a pain in the ass, dude. But I remember one of my friends, uh, Captain Falcon, was another good one. Did you say he was your friend? No, one of my friends played Captain oh, Falcon. Oh, I thought he said he was one of my friends. Well, I probably oh, cut it off. Captain Falcon. He was my friend. What are you talking about? <laughs> I knew him in real life. Um, but no, Captain Falcon, one of my friends played him. We, we had a group of us. There was like five or six of us that played the shit out of that game. There you go. You were right. Grim said 1986. There you go. I was just born in 1986. So that game is 35 years old. Oh, my God. Cutscene. Awesome, awesome point of view. Dude, you need to get this game. Oh, I'm definitely gonna get this game. Oh, it's our friend. Yeah, good luck. No, he's my friend. Does he look like he's your friend? He's staring at you with a red light. That That's danger. Have you ever seen a robot? Oh, you're gonna die. I'm not gonna die. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to do. He slid under his legs. We need to go. We should run. Is he still your friend? Uh, we might be buddies later on. Oh, God, he's like the fucking Terminator. Who's that? Butterflies? Oh, that's cool. JD's saying good year. 86? What about you, JD? You play a lot of... Did you play Smash Brothers at all? I love the new Super Smash Brothers. I love it. Absolutely. I still haven't tried it. I gotta bring for, it over. For, for the Switch, right? Yeah, I gotta bring it over. Why well, I just got... I, I love the new Super Smash Brothers. The energy from the central unit transformed the arm cannon into an Omega Cannon. Let's go. I'll, t I'll tell you, my favorite Super Smash Brothers, Smash Brothers game, like, everybody loves Melee, and I understand why, but but I will always be the N64 Smash Brothers. That, oh, that game has brought so many childhood memories. <laughs> yeah. I played the yeah. shit out of that game, and I was awesome at it. Hold on one to use aim, tilt. Once charged... Press Y while holding, while still holding R to fire. Wait, wait. Okay, hold on. Hold L to use aim mode. Hold R to charge. To a mega blaster. Hold charge. Press Y still. While still holding R to fire. Okay. I got it. There's like three different things I gotta do here. Yeah, there were there were like there were like three games on N64. Four, at, no, there were actually a few games, but uh, three of the games that I played all the time with my friends that we would have parties and and, and just up all night playing was Super Smash Brothers, F Zero, Mario Kart. Mario Kart. I know Jay played a lot. And of wait, Mario there's Kart. one more. Goldeneye. What? Goldeneye. What? We Goldeneye. played the fuck out of Goldeneye. We got uh, Grim coming in saying, you guys remember Metroid Prime? Yes, and I never played it. I don't never think I have it. What was that for? That was on the GameCube. There were three of them on the GameCube. And people I have were, a GameCube. People were actually anticipating on the next Metroid to be a Prime game, and it ended up being Metroid Dread instead. But everybody loves this game. I, I haven't heard anything bad about this game. Okay, so but there's three for the uh, GameCube three. that I can get. There's three Prime games. All right, yeah, we might have to stream some GameCube shit at some point. Good luck finding them. Dude. They're very expensive. That's all right. I'll save. I'll save. We'll do one at a time. I don't gotta buy all three of them at once. Right, right, right. Let's see. We got JD coming in a little bit when I was younger, but I don't play uh, the Switch version. Oh, okay, all right. 
the Switch version's probably the best one they've ever made. And it's got like a hundred something characters, which is crazy. It's a lot of characters. Um, I played a little bit of it. I didn't get into it that much, but uh, I have to say, like, it's it's a pretty awesome game. They released their last character. They released was um, Sora from uh, Kingdom Hearts. I don't know if any of you guys know Kingdom Hearts. That was one of my favorite games growing up. But I blew his face off. But yeah, that was the last Kingdom character Hearts? they released. Yeah, it was the last character they released on it uh, for DLC was uh, Sora. And they also have um, Sephiroth from uh, Final Fantasy VII. Wow, I just got an Omega Cannon, and it's already depleted and offline, reverting to the regular Arm Cannon. Alright, so we could get Omega Cannons, and that's how you deal with these metal dudes. Oh, uh, okay. Well, I don't know if you kill them, you might just disable them, right? I killed that motherfucker. Oh, I killed them, okay. But now I know how to get rid of them, so they're gonna have, like, the red on their face. Yeah. I gotta shoot with the Omega Cannon to get rid of them. Uh, but, okay, let's see. We got Grim over here. The fourth one is coming, uh, but in early 2019, development for it had uh, to be restarted. But it's coming to Switch. What the? Wait, the fourth one? What's coming? Metroid Prime. 4. Metroid Prime? Oh, dude. That's like literally one of the most anticipated games uh, ever. I'm dude. Because I, I heard the Prime games are, are the best. Uh, some people argue that they are the best. Metroid games in the entire series. The Prime? Yeah, the Prime games. They're first person, by the way. First person? Really? Yeah, first person. I gotta say right now, and I gotta, you know what, Oats and Goats, watching his speed run made me want to try these games. Yeah. So then when I saw that Super Metroid was on the Switch. Super Metroid it will always be the best game in the world. Like, I loved that game. And I, I even liked Metroid Other M. And uh, a lot of people did not like Other M. And I loved it. I'm down, right? I, at this point, with how much fun I'm having already, and how much fun I have with Super Metroid, yeah. like, I'm uh, willing to give shit a try. Look at this. Look other, at this. Other, oh, dude! Other M was very nostalgic to me. Was, uh, and, and, you, know, you know, they brought, like, the main villain back, which was Ridley. And, uh, Ridley! I do know Ridley. No, we don't need rockets for that. That's got to be opened a different way. Is this bad? No. <laughs> I didn't know, because it said earlier, like, there are going to be cold areas that are going to hurt me without the right suit. I guess I can't get up there. Yeah, that's probably something you're gonna have to come back to when you get a power up. Oh, I can't, I can't go underneath that now. It's gonna be like a double jump or something. Why are you trying to jump? Uh, can you bounce off the wall? No. Like this? Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. I was like, dude, there's no way you can soft lock yourself already, right? Yeah. <laughs> Very atmospheric game. Dude. Like, the music is creepy as fuck, dude. I love it. <laughs> it's kind of like a survival horror game, but... Sci-fi. Platformer. <laughs> no, I'm, yeah, I'm assuming you're gonna have to double bounce off... The, oh, never mind. I figured it out. I got this. We're exploring more cutscenes. Uh oh. Oh, come on, man. Looks like a stronger robot. Oh, I was right. It's a stronger robot. That's bad. Oh my god. Um, I'm 
I'm a little nervous. Um, there's concern. We gotta get the f out of here. We gotta go. Ah! Ah! You should follow me. Am I dead? You died. I might have panicked a little bit. You died. A little bit. Just a little bit. It's all right. It's all right. He was—he was a much more intimidating robot. Oopsie! I found out from a cousin how much space Modern Warfare requires on disc. It requires 188 gigs. Holy shit! So maybe I'll look into getting a copy on disc at some point. There you go, dude. For for wait what? For Modern PS Warfare P for PS4? Yeah. Yeah, we don't have dude. We we we're not like Oopsie. We don't have the five yet. Um, you bougie bastard. Yeah, uh, modern Modern Warfare is it actually is a lot of gigs, um, especially with all the patches and everything that came out with it. Um, I actually um, undownloaded it or deleted it off of my hard drive because I have so many games that my uh, external hard drive is already full, <laughs> and. Um, the PS5's internal hard drive sucks. Like, it's it's one terabyte, and literally, like, you download three PS5 games, and it already takes up all of the terabyte space. So I had to buy the external hard drive SSD. And, uh... Yeah, it's pretty much, it's pretty much filled. Um... But... I, I definitely recommend if anybody gets a PS5 to get an SSD uh, hard drive with a heat sink on it, and you can actually install that into the PS5. It gives you extra internal storage. Say and, that again. Uh, I was being chased. It's an SSD drive. Um, it's an external one, and you gotta. I would recommend buying like that. Right, the passport. The internal one. I'm sorry. You gotta buy one with a heat sink on it or else it'll fry it. Um, get an internal SSD that fits into the PS5 because it has an extra port where you can put extra, uh, uh, like a second SSD into it. Okay. It gives you more internal storage from the original storage that's already built into the PS5 because the original storage sucks. It's one terabyte and you only have like seven or 800 gigs free. And three of those PS5 games take up pretty much the entire like all of the space. Wow. It's bad. So these games are large and uh large. So 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 if you do get an uh, PS5, I would recommend you get an SSD, uh extra SSD with a heat sink on it. You install that and get at least something that has at least 2 to 4 terabytes. I know it's expensive. It's very expensive actually. But worth it. But definitely worth it. Well, you know the thing is, I know we talked about this the other night, Oopsie. Or last night was there's really like not a lot of titles out for PS5. There really is. There, there really isn't like no. Any. Nobody is really missing out on anything. I mean, the only thing you're missing out on is is having a new system, which everybody loves having a new system. You know, true. True. you know, it doesn't matter if there's a bunch of games out on or, or or not. And PS5 has released a, a good launch. Uh, a bunch of good launch titles. They have a lot of good games out right now. You know, they, they uh, Returnal is a great game. Um, Death Loop's a great game. Um, I can name a bunch of games. I wanted right to get the PS5. They're all awesome Because I wanted to stream Resident Evil 8 Village all oh, of it. Re uh, let me tell you, I have an LG CX, okay? It's one of the best TVs out there. It's a fifteen hundred dollar TV, or it was a fifteen hundred dollar TV, and it has one hundred and twenty hertz on it, uh, and it's a one hundred and twenty hertz TV. Um, it has free sync on it. It's a fucking fantastic TV. The picture is amazing. Okay. Yeah. Fifteen hundred dollars better be amazing. Yeah. Um, it's a four K TV. Dude, now, facts. The thing is, is that Resident Evil Eight is. One of the most beautiful games I've ever seen in my life. And when you have a 4K TV, 
and you're using the PS5 to its full potential on an amazing TV like that, there's no par there's no comparison. It's just it's mind blowing. It, it looks amazing. Amazing. And I will have to say, Resident Evil 8 blew me the fuck away. Speaking of which, now, now this is what we got you here, and I know back when we we, we, um, we picked up Resident Evil 8 Village and we did a giveaway of two posters, have you even seen your poster? I have seen the poster, I just never took it. Oh, okay, okay. You showed it to me a few times, and okay. I keep leaving it here. Yeah. I'm about to just... I'll, I'll, I'm, I'm about to just put it up in my car. I almost put it on my wall, and I was just not going to tell him about Literally, it. Literally, just put it up in my I was going to put it on the door and just be like, you don't get this anymore. Yeah, well, I mean, <laughs> I wouldn't blame you. I wouldn't blame you. Nah, I feel like with that poster, because it's a nice poster, and like you said, how great Resident Evil 8 was, how oh, we all feel about game. it. I started playing it again. I was, I, you know, I was telling Matt, I, I'm still, you know, I've got to go back and play 7, because 7, I, I absolutely love 7. Uh, yeah, I'm not exactly sure if uh, eight is my favorite or if seven is my favorite. Oh, I definitely like eight more than seven. I just I like I like seven story wise more. Yeah, yeah. Um, although I do like eights, but I like the because I feel like seven was way scarier. Yeah, it was scarier. Well, it eight, was scary. They dumbed down eight because seven was too scary. That's what they were trying. That's what people were complaining. Yeah. About. But I like I like that I like the how scary seven was, but I love the gameplay mm. in eight. It's just and, and, and like you said, the, the graphics, the look, everything is yeah. just amazing. It, it just the the different areas of the entire map, the the boss fights, people were bitching about the boss fights not being that great. I thought they were awesome. I'll tell you, Mr. Moreau was probably one of my best one of my favorite boss fights. The big fish thing. <laughs> I gotta say, uh, Lady Demetrius was probably one of my favorite fights. And my favorite part of the game was uh, um, the escape room type thing that they did yeah. from the original, from Seven. Uh, Bene Beneviento. Yeah, that, I loved it. I absolutely loved that with the baby, the big ass yeah, weird baby creepy. running around. It kind of reminded me of something that Hideo Kojima would do. You know what I mean? Like, like it just that weirdness of it. Never when he was supposed to make Silent Hill. You know? Yeah, yeah. Without a doubt. Never leaves its assigned zone. Their control systems must permit them to operate only within that range. But, yeah, I, I, I'll tell you, dude, like, um, Modern Warfare, I played that game for three years straight. And uh, one of my favorite modes was Gunfight. Yeah, Gunfight. We had a lot of fun. I loved Modern Warfare. I loved that game. I think it was a great game. Uh, a lot of people had a problem with the maps. Um, I didn't really play multiplayer uh, like the like the regular multiplayer that much. I played Gunfight. That's all I played, and I literally I could spend hours playing that. That's how much I love it. And um, I'll tell you, Modern Warfare is a fantastic game. Vanguard, not really that great of a game. It has Champion Hill, which is a lot of fun. Um, the new Caldera map is awesome. It's just very broken. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I, I might. I might pick it up. I'm, you know what I want to do first is I want to see. The only reason I pick it up is if the zombies were decent. Zombies are not decent. Yeah. They uh, zombies are terrible from what I heard. I haven't even played the zombies yet, but I heard it was the worst zombies experience ever. See, I gotta see what it looks like. Yeah. But I didn't really like Cold War zombies. Well, you gotta think about it. You, you got Sledgehammer Games that made this game, right? Vanguard. And and Sledgehammer does not have a good pass. They don't have a good record. They're not, one of the worst developers ever when it comes to Call of Duty. Yeah. Um, none of their games were ever good. And Vanguard is a pretty decent game. The problem is, is that Activision is going through a lot of shit right now. And uh, nothing is getting solved or fixed. So it's a very broken game. And uh, if they fixed it, it would be, be a great game. Um, but they're not fixing it. We got Grim saying, on Village of Shadows, it was a bitch, but I beat its ass, uh, despite the difficulty. Nice, dude. Yeah, so you, you platinum that one, too, right, Grim? What, eight? Eight, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. Okay, so we got a... Oh, we got more rockets up there, dude. Even, even like, with, uh, even the, uh, the remakes. I, I will literally say this that Resident Evil 2 Remake 
is literally the best remake that I've ever seen somebody handle in my entire life. Like, I've never seen a game remade as perfect as that game is. Resident Evil 3, I liked it. I love Resident Evil 3 remake. Again, I didn't really care for the original. And, you know, I wish they did a little bit more with the third one. I don't really care too much about, like, the uh, Nemesis. I think he could have been a lot better. Dude, Nemesis was so badass, though. He, he looks great. I just think um, the way they, they the way they advertised that game was Nemesis was going to follow you through the entire game. You were going to have, like, more... It was, it was choreographed. And, and then you find out that it's literally only, like, the first half of the game, basically. And he only is stuck to a certain area. And... Mm -hmm. Like, that really pissed me off, because I was looking forward to him following you through the entire game. Which almost actually, in my opinion, makes the original game better than the remake. But, I don't really like either game, to be honest. Like, I like like I wouldn't say I don't like them. I, I'll say that they're not my favorite. Yeah. And, That's uh, fair. And, uh, but I definitely will say that Resident Evil 2 Remake was literally the best remake that has ever been done. Besides Final Fantasy VII. I don't know how to get that rocket, dude. We got Grim over here saying, uh, right? I'll look into getting a copy of Modern Warfare, but I'll play it. But I'll play it until I get the Platinum. Same with Vanguard, if I get that. I'll just do it to get, pl so yeah, to add more Platinums to the record. I see you, Grim. Yeah, so you're a Platinum guy. You like to platinum games, oh, yeah, dude, which, is, which is pretty awesome. I mean, some guys, some people are into that. They just want to platinum, and then they never touch. You gotta have a lot of patience. Again. You definitely have a lot, a lot. I of think patience. Grim, how many platinums you have? And I think you have over two hundred, right? Yeah, he's a platinum guy. He likes. Yeah. He, he likes to. Uh, yeah. I haven't gotten villages plat yet because I need to finish two more maps on mercenaries. Oh shit! You're close though. But I'll, I'll tell you though, Vanguard is not a bad game. It's a very broken game, but it's not a bad game at all by any means, which I'm surprised because Sledgehammer sucks. Um, and Caldera is literally... Uh, I love Caldera. I love that map from, um, oh, for, boy. for, for uh, Battle Royale. I, I love it way more than I like Ver Verdansk. I hated Verdansk. Verdansk was boring. Like I like I just did not like that map at all. Yeah, I just I, dude, Call of Duty is it. basically done for me. Yeah. Like I I I no, I, I picked up Cold War just to see. I loved Blackout. I um, loved Blackout it. was a lot of fun, but I also liked the zombies in that one as well, dude. Yeah, I love Blackout. Matt was the one who got me into Battle Royale. He mm -hmm. he showed me Blackout, and I was hooked. For those of you that don't know who he's talking about, I'm Matt. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Whiskers uh, got me hooked on uh, on on Blackout. I never played a battle royale before. I wasn't interested. I don't. Uh, I'm an arena shooter guy. Yeah. I'm, I'm a Halo guy. Okay. I grew up playing Halo, which the new Halo is amazing, by the way. I'm just gonna point that out to you people who are PlayStation fans. Dude, I liked Halo. I know you loved Halo. We used to land party all the time. Yo, we got Kyla Ren in chat saying, hey guys, what's happening, Kyla? How you doing, man? Yo. Kylo, how goes it, good friend? So this is just like a zone area, right? We can't, can we blow through that shit? Ah! No, okay. I don't even know where you are right now. And I don't know where I am either, man. It's crazy. See a slug up top? See, we got Grim saying, yep, just got his 213th platinum. Dude, geez, geez, man, awesome. Good, more power to you, man. Uh oh, it knows where I am. Oh, uh, he gonna fuck you up. Hey. Uh oh. Uh oh, he knows. He knows. Ah. Uh, you only died once, right? Uh, I think so. I think we're. I think we're good. I think. What is, what is that that's in the center there? We need... That's a rocket, so it'll boost my rockets up by two more. Yeah, you can't get in there right now? I don't know how. I you think gotta, I need the roly-poly no, thing. No, do a half jump. Do like a half flip jump. There, yeah, there you go. Now try to go in. I, I am. 
how do you how do you roll how do you turn into the circle thingy? We haven't picked that up yet. We really? haven't. I thought that, that was like a mainstay thing. I thought that. Literally no, was like that's a that's something power. you pick up. That's bullshit. This is this is a this is a sketch area, dude. This is a pretty solid game, though. I like this. Oh, hold on. Will this give me like more rockets? Yes, it will. Dude, yeah, this is a lot of fun right now, man. Well, these these type of games are right up your alley. You love this shit. I do like platformers. Some of the games that I wanted, which I have now, you gotta get Donkey Kong Tropical. Dude, I gotta do one at a time now. Yeah. I just got Luigi's Mansion Three. I got this, and I got oh, Super no, no, no. Mario Maker Two. He's first, but I'm saying your next game because it's probably cheap now. You should get Donkey Kong uh, Tropical. Uh, I was never a huge Thunder? Donkey Kong guy. I know Grim, right? You're it's a big a, Donkey Kong guy. It's a lot of fun, guy. though. I'll tell you, I love the dunk, the newer Donkey Kong games. I think they're great. Mm. I, I love the old Donkey Kong games. Yeah? Yeah, I, I was I was a fan. I liked the first and second one more than I liked the third one, but I did beat the third one. I think I have the second. I, I think I have Donkey Kong Country 2 for Super Nintendo. Yeah. We got Kylo over here saying, I'm good. Have I mentioned I have a new job working uh, for DPD? As a parcel sorter. Dude, that's awesome, man. Congratulations. Sight. How are you liking it so far? How are you enjoying it? Okay, this is bad. I should really... I should really think about what I'm doing here. I think it's not going to go anywhere. Shh, 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 shh. We're going to be just fine. You need to stop panicking. Before you run out, though, can you uh, give me a road soda, please? Yeah. Grim over here saying, that's what happens when you've been trophy hunting for almost 11 years. Trophy hunt or not at all, I can't just game anymore. I trophy hunt now hard, dude. That's what th that's awesome though. I know I know a lot of people, I know a lot of people that play the games uh, for for platinuming it. That that's literally they they, they it's they have to platinum the game. I think it's pretty cool. I got so never, close, they never play it again. They, they, they literally platinum, they get everything they need out of it, and then they, they, you know, they move on to the next game. You know what, though? I know Grim, not, that's not how he goes about it. No, I'm it. sure that's not how he goes, but I know a lot of people are just, you know, they're platinum teams, you know? They just want to get, they want to platinum the game, they want to move on to the next one, and then they, they play the next one, they platinum that one. Oh, boy. I'm a little concerned. About a current situation here. I have no idea where I'm going. I don't. I think that's the point. I think you're not really supposed to know where you're going. Can I breathe underwater? I'm supposed to kind of figure it out. It doesn't look like you're dying, so I think you're good. Ah, we're good. Ooh, there's a big thing up there. Maybe it's power yeah. Up. Uh oh, you might get your first power up. Let's see if that's power up. Oh uh, no, you need the rolly thing. <laughs> Such bullshit. I'm sure there's another way to get to it. But dude, yo, I tried and I and I, and I, I remember too, I gotta give credit to Grim on this one because he tried helping me platinum Resident Evil 3 remake. Yeah. And I got a little too fucking cocky and I was like, I got this. I got this. I'm doing it without a rocket launcher. And I got through all the modes. And then I got to the last difficulty, Inferno, and I got all the way through the game. Yeah. With the infinite assault rifle, because I made sure I didn't. I bought everything else in case I got stuck. Yeah. And I got to the final nemesis fight. Couldn't beat him. Spent three hours having him toss my ass around like a rag doll. Don't you just need to get the fucking? Don't you just need to break the ray rifle off and then? You gotta it? yeah, but you gotta charge it. Now the thing is, nemesis on harder difficulties in the final fight. He has more pus things, and his attacks are way more aggressive and frequent. Oh, okay. So if you don't got perfect dodges down, he stun locks you, and he beats you to death. He is. But he's one of my favorite villains of all time, especially one of my favorite Resident Evil I, enemies. I, I definitely like uh, Nemesis more than I like Mr. X. Um, but I, I definitely like Lady Demetra now. Lady Demetresque? Yeah, she yeah. got a nice butt. We got Kyle over here. I'm loving it. Um, 
definitely one of the better jobs I've held in four years, and I get paid weekly. Oh, dude, so you had one of those jobs you were getting paid bi-weekly before, huh? Yeah, bi-weekly. I've had that before. That bi-weekly shit sucks. Dude, dude, you get that check, and you think you have so much money, because that's what would happen to me, is I would get my, when I worked for yeah. the pharmacy, I won't say what pharmacy, but when I worked for the pharmacy, I was getting paid bi-weekly, and... Even the grocery I, I, store that we worked at. The grocery store we worked at. Was that at, bi-weekly? It was bi-weekly. Yo, me and this guy worked in a bakery together. Can you imagine the kind of shit we got into? We should have got fired right away. Yeah, I don't know how we held on to that for three months. Yeah, we also didn't get trained very well either. We so. got trained for a day. Oh, there's an E-tank. Yeah. I want that. Nice little bat, dude. But... Long story short, we worked in a bakery and we used to change the prices on shit because we had no idea what the fuck they cost. Yeah, we we heard. So we, we randomly would just put price tags on the shit and did, but and they weren't the actual price. I gave somebody and, a cake once, and, and we used to eat everything out of the out of the display case. And she used to think that they sold like. So well, she no, would, it wasn't everything. So he's being dramatic oh, no, right no, no, now. No. So, I would eat the mini. Cannolis and I eat the eclairs. And you always ate the eclairs. And she would always come in and go, "Wow, those are selling really good." Meaning, meanwhile, we were eating all of that shit. And, yeah, listen, we were we were like uh, we were in our what were we teenagers? Yeah, we uh, we stole a lot from that place. Well, no, only 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 eclairs and and we slept a lot in the in the cooler because we were both hung over all the we were both hung over all the time. Should have trained us better. I remember I burned the shit out of my fucking but, hand. Oh, to geez. our defense, though, they did not train us at all. No. And that woman actually got fired. Our our man. I heard about that. I heard about that. But uh, what was I gonna say? Dude, not having this roly poly thing was really frustrating. And I hated writing on cakes. Writing on cakes was rough. I used to tell them that we I, didn't But have it. she didn't teach me how to use... She didn't teach either one of us. No. There was like a scan book, and it's how you figured out the price of cakes. And she showed... It was one of those, like, she showed it to us once, and then never again. Yeah. We had and no it, idea how to use that fucking thing. And I remember, like, I, I, I once gave somebody, like, a, a, a seriously, like, crazy cake. I gave for, shit, like, to, I gave $6. shit to people for free. <laughs> I literally, I'm like, here, I just, just walk out with it. I don't really even care. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not even gonna put a res. Not even, I'm not even gonna put anything on this. Are you serious? No, I'm definitely serious because I have no idea how much this costs. Just, just fucking here you go. Yeah, I think we just updated our map. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm and I used to have customers because they'd be like, "Can you, can you write on the cake?" Not really. I'm new. I, I don't know how to do it. Can I come back there and do it? Yeah, sure. That happened to me once. I would let them do it. Or I would tell them that we were out of certain... Uh, we were. Uh, they'd be like, Dude, do you have blue frosting? No. The are do you have orange? So no. The the do you have anything? No, we're out of everything. Dude, I used to get so... But what's that back there? I see that I... right behind you. What is... <laughs> the rack I'd would be, be like, oh, you. oh, that? Oh, I didn't see that. Dude, it was, it was, it was rough, because I remember, like, I have terrible handwriting... And I remember, I felt so bad, because I remember, like, it was, like, a couple's anniversary, and I butchered this. Like, I tried so <laughs> hard to write happy, like, like, it was, like, happy 30th anniversary. And, like, and now the pressure was on, because I knew, like, that's that, you 30 years together. Like, oh, my God, that's amazing. Congratulations. And then I remember when I handed her the cake, and I, I knew it didn't look good. And she looked at it, and, like, and then looked at me, and I was like... Before she even said anything, I was like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's just like my second week here, and they left me here by myself. And yeah. And when you told me this whole 30th anniversary story, it was really touching, and I tried yeah. to do it right. And, and that, that's when I had that moment where she was like, can I come back there and give it a shot? And I was like, yeah, I'm probably going to get fired anyway, so just, yeah, why not? Yeah, we got Grim over here saying, yeah, I'm not uh, being a pessimist. And everyone's different, but from experience, I truly don't recommend going into the last fight on Nightmare and Inferno without the rocket launcher. Dude, I feel you now, dude. I get it now. You know, my, my I've definitely been humbled by Resident Evil 3 Remake. 
I know a lot of streamers do it legit, but <laughs> save yourself the headache. Uh, don't do it legit just to prove you have a big sack like the average Joe. <laughs> nah, dude, I definitely, because I do want a platinum that game, and what I ended up having to do is I ended up having to delete my save file because I didn't have points to buy the Infinite Rocket Launcher because I bought everything else. Uh, okay. And so I had to start from scratch <laughs> again. I smell pickles. Dude, now I want to eat them damn beer jelly beans now. Mm -hmm. Like, your snakes smell like pickles. You does not smell like pickles. How do I do that fucking move? Oh, there it is. Why do I smell pickles? I don't know. I think there's something wrong with you. Is that a fucking... Is a fucking stingray flying in the air? Oh, motherfucker! I don't appreciate you. There's a lot going on. Oh my god! So, I looked down at chat. Yo, and Grim redeeming some some so channel treats for some more beer beans. You down for another beer bean? Yeah, I'll do another beer, beer bean. Um, so I am confused though. So you have two screens up right now. So what what's the difference between both screens? Oh, this? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You, you just know. noticed this? No, no, no. I, I, but it's. I see. It's the same thing. So what's the difference? It looks like one All right, monitor. All right. So shit. this is Streamlabs OBS. Okay. This is okay. what we're streaming to Twitch off of. Okay. Um. This is Twitch. This is. Oh, I get it now. Okay. Which, this is how I'm reading the chat. And and that's literally how you control everything. Certain, yeah. Okay. All okay. the scene selections. All and right. Stuff? That makes that makes sense. Okay. All right, so you know what? I picked the first one. Oopsie, you picked the next bag. All right. We got, we got our... Hold on, we got to switch the screen. Hold on. I'm sorry about that. Grim, thank you for redeeming some channel treats, bro. We're going to we're gonna pick our next bag of drugs. Because that's literally what they look like. They're jelly beans. They're not drugs. They look like drugs. Watch, he's going to pick the IPA I'm just going to randomly pick one. I don't even care. Yeah, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. All right, hold on. So the ones we have in the can, if hand me the can real quick. Yeah. So the ones we have in the can already are the ones that we we just recently tried, except for this bag. Hold on, you got another bag in here. Oh, I do. Okay. There you go. All right. So these are the ones we've already tried. I imagine. I don't know if they're all the same. I imagine they're not because all right. they're in separate baggies. Pick a hand. This one. All right. All right. We got these ones. Bad boy open. Which ones are those? I don't know. It doesn't say on them. Oh, okay. I'll tell you though, they, they, they do smell like beer. Can't tell. It's good. It's not bad. What do you think? Pilsner? Take a Pilsner? Yeah. Well, we're going to dump these in with these ones as well, this way in the future. It sucks that they don't say it on the back. It Which does. Is... Are they all the same? I don't think so. Do they all look like the same color? They are the same color. They are? I hope they're not the same jelly beans. Hold on. They are the same. Try that, there's a different bag. It tastes just like the other one. Shit! There it is. Save it! it tastes the same, right? It is the same. Alright, they're the same. You know what though? I don't care. They're fucking delicious. So maybe it's like a maybe it's like a, each can is uh um, You could get different cans, you think? Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'm I gonna open these and dump them in there. But I don't know which ones these are. What, what would these I can't be? place. Yeah, whether it's a, I think I want to say it's a lager. Doesn't even say. All right. Well, either way, they all taste the same. No. Yeah. I like them though. I like them. It's even got like the lid looks like a cap. Do 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 do. You launched one over here. Oh, 
About all of them? Yeah, I think so. Alright, cool. I'm keeping this can afterwards. They are yummy, though. They really are. They are a treat. Definitely gonna keep... I'm keeping that in the channel rewards. Uh, you know what, though? We're gonna take a quick break. I gotta use the bathroom real quick. Or actually, you wanna... You wanna take over and play while I'm using the bathroom? No, because I gotta use the bathroom, too, and I'm gonna... I'm gonna... <sighs> Disappear for five seconds. He's gonna disappear for five seconds. All right, hold on. Where is our be right back? There it is. There we go. So we'll be plus, right back, everybody. Plus, I don't want you to miss anything anyway. All right, all right. True. Fair enough. Fair enough. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere, meow. We're gonna get back into uh, some uh, some more Metroid Dread in just a minute. All right, all right, all right. Ba 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 ba. We can we can cancel that out real quick. Let's get back into some more Metroid Dread. Oopsie will be back in just a little bit. He just went out for a smoke real quick. Respecting the stream. That is a big motherfucker. First try. We got, we, what is this? Missile, oh, missile tank acquired. We increased our missile. Our missiles by more. We gotta look at the map, I think. I'm a little, I'm a little, uh, yellow or save areas. This is a question mark. What is this? This is a question mark. Dude, have we really explored all of this so far? Holy shit, this game is big. What is this? I gotta start playing RE4 again. I'm watching a playthrough of it, and now I've got that bug up my head. Dude. That's how I felt about RE8. All this all this talk about Village over the last night, and seeing it on Twitter, how it, like, you know, won Steam Awards. <laughs> like, I was like, I gotta go through and play this game again. And I was, I, I was looking... Dude, Grim, I was still looking at them. I was looking at speedrun.com, and I noticed there's still a lot of openings for, uh, for, for for world records. And I was actually quite surprised. I checked out um, the category that you normally play in, New Game Plus, um, Glitchless. 
You haven't submitted any runs to, because uh, I know you said you beat Ari uh, Resident Evil Village in, in a really good time. I was just wondering, uh, you never submitted any runs. I didn't see your name in there, dude. figure out how to get in there. Ah, son of a bitch. Stop hitting me. I went get it. I want the thing. I want the thing. I guess, yeah, we're going to have to go into roly-poly mode for this. That's the only thing that makes sense to me. I'm surprised we haven't gotten roly-poly mode -y. What did I just say? Yeah. Yeah, that's because if you die in a run and submit, they're not going to accept it. And a dozen of my runs go to hell when Moreau, uh, um, when, uh, Moreau is chasing me on those platforms. Because shit kills me sometimes on those platforms. Ah, I feel you, man. You ever thinking about submitting a run though? Like, uh, you ever gonna you ever gonna get back into it? Like, I what? Yeah, you're right. I was reading the rules, and and I didn't think of that. What is that? What is the green door? Oh, there's more. There's more over there. I'll try getting my rhythm back soon. Yeah, there you go, dude. I can understand the frustration, though, man. So when I Google the jelly beans, it immediately kicks me off the website that would tell me about them. But I believe it's all one flavor and say you should try them with other flavors like lemon, orange, and apple. They say you should try them with other flavors like lemon. Dude. JD, that makes... That makes so much sense. Combining with different flavored jelly beans. Because right now I'm drinking orange, Bud Light Orange. Yo, JD just put some knowledge in chat right now. What happened? He said he uh, he tried going to the website uh, for for these for these for these uh, these jelly beans. Yeah. And he goes, it says from what he was able to gather, it kept kicking them out. But from what he was able to gather. They're all one flavor, but it suggests that you pair them with lemon, orange, and lime jelly beans to add to it. Just kind of like I'm drinking orange Bud Light right now. Oh, okay. I'm going to have to pick those up. Thank God there's no IPA flavor in that thing. Dude, they're so good. Although though. Jackie said they taste like IPA. Everybody tastes them differently. Like, I didn't get a root beer taste. I See, I got a root beer taste. Mm. I think my sense is just suck out. Everyone's taste buds are probably a little differently. Well, I'm sure everybody's taste buds are different, because, uh, you know, like, do you like asparagus? I love asparagus. I hate asparagus. Especially if you put that roasted garlic in that shit. Roasted garlic? Oh, shit. Or balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar? Vinaigrette? I do, I do. Oh, shit. Oh, he knows we're here. Or sometimes even a little Worcester sauce or uh, sesame, or not sesame, uh, soy sauce. He knows we're here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm panicking. I never used to like broccoli rob. I love broccoli rob. Uh, I'm okay it with it. Depends on how they cook it. If it's too hard and crunchy, I don't like it. It has to be soft. And a lot of restaurants make it like too hard. What is this? He's here! I did, I did shoot one at it. Oh, you did? Didn't work. Maybe panicking a little bit. 
This thing is chasing me. What is this? Flood your ass. You gotta understand, Mr. Monster Friend. I have evaded people like the tyrant. You are nothing. Uh oh. That thing just doesn't stop me. Ah! I talk shit! I talk shit! Ah! Ah! Okay, we clearly have to fill that. Did you ever play Alien Isolation on stream? Yeah, I did it for one of like my uh, October games. Yeah. Um, I love that game. It was all right. It was all right. I love that game. I thought that was a good game. Can you get Lemon Miller? Uh, we haven't seen anything. I haven't seen any JD Ash, yeah, that was JD. Um, you I'm can sure get it now. That you said you something. can get Bud Light Lemonade, and I've had I've had that one. But I don't like it. Tastes good, but I don't recommend drinking. Like have like maybe one or two of them, because yeah. I, I I it was like on a Saturday night. I bought a twelve pack, and Sunday my mouth was so dry from like yeah. the lemonade. If you have heartburn issues, usually, like, sugar beer drinks are not really, like, they're not my thing. I yeah. can't. I can't drink Bud Light Lime because then I end up getting really bad heartburn. And I love Bud Light Lime. I just, I can't drink it. It's like he's drinking Bud Light Orange right now. I, I would probably love it, but I, my stomach wouldn't be able to take it. Man. Okay, so I gotta get him. You gotta drive his ass. I think I gotta crush his ass. He's really fast. Why, why isn't that doing anything else? I think it was just to raise the platform so you could use the little, uh, so you could get in that tunnel with the circle thing. And you turn into a ball. Oh! Oh, this over here? Yeah. Shit. I, I think you need the ball, uh, thing to get through there, and it, the rate, all it did was raise the platform so you were able mm. to get into it with the... We gotta find this ball. Yeah, I know. Is this, you think this is it over here? What is this? I Central unit. Does it even tell you where fucking power-ups are? Like, well, we don't know what some of this stuff is. I would go to the questions. question marks. Go yeah. to the question marks and see what, you know, you can... Well, uh, we have obtain. one over here I that we like can't get. I feel like the red ones to. mean you can't obtain them at all right now. I feel like the, the yellow ones So mean, this is this is probably it. Yeah, the yellow ones probably mean that you can probably get it. We gotta get back up there. So we gotta go left. Yeah. And then we gotta climb up. Yeah, because I feel okay. like the red ones mean you can't get it until you get another power-up. We got JD saying, nah, we used to get the, this MGD Miller Chill, and it was either lemon or lime, and can't get them anymore. Good, isn't it? MGD Miller Chill. Have you ever heard of those? And no, never. I've never heard of those. That sounds awesome. That sucks. It, oh! It might have been, it might have been something that they only distributed in, in uh, certain areas, including Canada. Shit. Because I know that there's a lot of things in North America that we do not get, or mm. we won't get right away. But he just said they don't, it's like they don't make them anymore yeah. either, so it's like, well, there goes that idea. Like they, they used to have an energy drink called cocaine, and it literally had know. cocaine in it. No, 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 it was, no, it didn't, li no, it didn't have cocaine in it. There it was so like much, had cocaine there was it. so much caffeine in it that, like... It felt like you were on cocaine. Yeah. Like, and, uh, they, they banned that shit. They don't have it anymore. Got Grim over here saying, Oh, did you guys see the Welcome to Wel Raccoon City is coming on digital? And I, ate, I know you tagged me on that. It's coming out February 8th on digital and Blu-ray? No. It's coming out on the 18th on Blu-ray. Wait, digital on the 18th. And February 8th, it's coming out on Blu-ray. I okay. gotta watch that movie. Actually, my uh, my nephew got me to sign behind uh, Oopsie's head right there. The Welcome to Raccoon City. Made sure we put that over there. Yeah, Get I that gotta watch that I, movie. I enjoyed it. I don't care what... Uh, I think I'm gonna enjoy it, too. I mean, I... I, I 
don't understand why everybody turned it into what they needed to turn it into. But. It wasn't the game, and that was. You're like, you're really not gonna want to watch a movie that is exactly oh. like the game. Fucking a. My my thing is is like, why 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 would you want to watch a movie that pl that runs exactly like the game when you can just go play the goddamn game? I know. Like it was, it was, it was, and then not to give any spoilers out there for those that haven't seen it, like yourself. Yeah. But um, the the like I said, the Easter eggs and everything they put in there, I get. The only gripe I understand, <laughs> but it's not even like that upsetting to me, was um, it's like a two-hour movie, and they crammed a lot in two hours, so not a lot of character development. But really, it it, it wasn't it wasn't enough to ruin the movie. For me. Yeah, I feel like though, if you're gonna turn the game, if you're gonna turn that movie, or you're planning on doing sequels to it, you really don't need to cram that much into a two-hour movie. You I focus, don't think they're going to. You focus on certain characters, and then you just build from there. Cause honestly, I think the job, the jobs that the actors that portrayed Leon and Jill, I think they did a phenomenal job acting. Um, but honestly, I don't think with 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 how. Um, they were treated on social media by some of the fan base. I don't think we'll see a sequel. It's just kind of, you know. Well, they kind of, they, they had to make it, um. God damn it, I fucking missed them. Got him that time. What were you saying? Sorry. No, I just, I, I didn't really want to talk about that because I don't want to talk about that on the stream. But, um. It's just very negative crap, and it, 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 like, there's no need for that. You know, like, it, it, I won't get into it. I'm sure if you guys go and look it up, you'll you'll know what I'm talking about. Yeah. I'm not gonna get I'm not gonna get to it on stream because I don't want to talk about that on that stream. But I just feel like it was very negative, and uh, there's no need for that. It was just... Let's let's go. Okay, we got what 21 rockets. Let's throw a save down. Yeah, I think I'm definitely going to pick it up. I think I'm going to pick it up on Blu-ray so I can watch it off the PlayStation. Okay, so we have to... We're trying to get ourselves over... What is... We have question marks over here, too. Um, now, these like, gray areas? These gray areas? I this is where the robot dude is, Jason. See, Dizzy likes being on the stream. I, I, I feel like it's the. I feel like the yellow ones you are able to obtain right now. The, the, That's where we're going. And the red ones we can't get because we don't have certain things. Because yeah. look, even these missile tanks are red, and yeah. these are areas we can't get yeah, into. Ex exactly. And that looks like a boss up there, by the way. What that, this? No, go up. That that head, that skull thing. That this helmet. thing. Total recharge oh, station. Oh, re recharge station. Okay, never mind. Yeah, so I'm gonna go for the yellow shit first. Try to. Try All right. To get so up we're there. gonna go back. Yeah, cause we can't get this one. Wow, you actually traveled pretty fucking far. I know, dude. Look, look at how much of the map we have. Can yes. we? Can I? Can I zoom out? How do I zoom out? Here we go. Yeah, you actually got pretty far. Not bad. Not bad. And now you gotta go all the way back. <laughs> cause. <laughs> Because we traveled, we traveled too far, chat. We traveled too far. We we missed everything. Well, that's what I like about this game. Uh, the, that's what that. Well, it's a Metroidvania feel right there. Yeah. You can go all the way back through the entire map, and you got to go back. And Although get we can't, we can't get out this way. No. No. So wait, you can't go back up. We can't go back up that way. Uh oh. So how are you gonna get back up there? We we have to explore this area. Yeah, maybe you're going the right way then. You think? Yeah. Yeah, you're probably going the right way then. If you can't go back the way you came because you don't have certain things. This I mean, looks this looks like something we could shoot. Uh, maybe it's like a fridge. Yeah, but you're still gonna need the uh, the ball thing. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Oh. It's not very fast in water, It's kind of slow. I bet you we get a suit. I'm willing to bet we get a suit that makes us better in water. 
Asexual hey, lady. I think, see, I think I was supposed to make that jump over to that platform. And I keep fucking it up. How do I get back up? What's up there with a man? You worried about that guy? Ain't worried about oop, worried about that guy though. I'm gonna jump into it. Get out of here! Oh! oh God. Jump over it. There you go. Don't even, don't even waste don't even waste your time. Just jump over it. I got this. We got this. Everybody's good. Everything's good. Okay, so I gotta time this. You got it this time. Yeah, but you still can't get through. Son of a bitch! Maybe you gotta go up. Did you try to go up yet? Yeah. There was nothing with the up? Nah. This is fucking nuts. Go right. This way? Yeah. We're gonna figure this out. Yeah, this is where we ended up here. Oh, fuck, man. I'm gonna say you missed something all the way in the beginning of that, but I don't. I don't see how the game would stop you from progressing and not let you go back. Exactly, so. right? Like we, it's gotta let us. It's gotta let us keep going, right? Yeah, exactly. That's what Metroid is all about. Like, even if you miss something, you can still always go back to get it. Yeah. So we got Grim saying the director stated that he wants to adapt Code Veronica into a movie. Then Resident Evil 4, he also wants to adapt Resident Evil 7 Village into movies as well. That would be fucking Seven cool. would be amazing. Code Veronica, definitely not. No, I would check it out. I, I, I it love out. Coro uh, I love Code Veronica. I didn't beat Code I Veronica I love that yet. game. I absolutely love that game. But I'll tell you, that's not going to be a good movie. I'd give it a chance. I mean, I'd give it a chance, but I'm just saying I don't think it's going to be a good movie. But Resident Evil 7? Oh, fuck yeah, that would be a great movie. We gotta go, we gotta go here. There's something, there's something we're missing in here. They should get Matthew McConaughey to play Jack Baker. <laughs> Is that a bad, that's a bad thing. That's bad, that's bad. get Norman Reedus to play uh, the crazy guy with the escape room. What was the brother's name? I can't remember. Oh, um... Is it Clive or Cletus or some shit? No. Yo, he's coming after me. They do a Code Veronica movie and have uh, Steve in it. Um, make him less of a dork. <laughs> yeah, I still gotta beat that one. That was a great game. I know um, Code Veronica. I, I know. I know. Uh, what's his name? Didn't really care for it. Who? Um, Sal's brother. Oh, Joey. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know Imagine. he didn't really care for it, but I, I, I absolutely love that game. I thought it was good. We gotta go. We gotta fucking go. Everybody gotta go. Are you sure you can't turn into a circle? It hasn't taught me yet. It's usually like, like a power up. Start off with it. It's crazy, man. I can't do that right now. Really being gypped. We got a glitch in the matrix here. We got problems. We do have problems. 
we have no idea where we're going. We can't get out of this section. I keep hitting the wrong fucking button. That little, that little Perry. Perry! It's, uh, it's the X button. But I keep hitting the top buttons, thinking that that's, that's what I gotta do. It's not. Son of a bitch. See, now what was that, what, when you go in there, when you go in back in that room, the, the, the room that you just came out of. What, you this is the same station. Those. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, okay. I always remember those like power in the suit or some shit. Right, somehow you gotta get over there. Yeah, but we can't get over there anymore. Well, I feel like that's the gray area, right? So you haven't even uh, discovered that yet. No, yeah, we have. Because oh, you see okay. how it's like this pants and stuff? Okay. Oh, oh, I know what we gotta do. We gotta slide down this hole, not roly poly. Yeah. <laughs> you like you like oops. Yeah. 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 Ah, oh, fuck you. Duh. Duh. Hey. Duh. Listen, listen, everybody. I might not be the first to cross the finish line, but I get there. All right? It's not a race. It's a marathon. I don't. I forgot which direction I'm going. He's already. not the sharpest tool in the shed. He's the dullest. But he finds his way eventually. <laughs> that ain't right. You ain't right, man. What the fuck is that thing? <gasps> I think Jackie's running around. Oh, we gotta go. Oh! Why did we never know? Why did we not think about that? Cause I didn't think to do that. We fucking did it though. We did it, chat. That looks like a boss down there. Not ready for a boss. What are you talking about? I'm oh, ready no, for my boss. No, they're gonna load me up. Power up? Load me up. Mr. Statue, load me up. Isn't that the guy that kicked your ass in the beginning? <laughs> I don't know. It could be. So he beat the shit out of you just to help you through the rest of the game? Well, then I turned his ass into a statue. Well, not only that, but he's like, let me beat you up and change your suit. And, uh, and now I'm gonna help you. It's because I turned his ass into a statue. So now he's your bitch. He's my friend. Talking about my best friend. I'm so lost. But we've made progress. And that's all that matters right now. Right, everybody? I right. didn't know about that tunnel. What is up? Why is that wall blue? Uh... Why is the sky blue? Because it reflects the ocean. Why is the ocean blue? Because it reflects the sky. What the fuck? Yeah, I shot that guy. So... So those, uh... How do we get in here? Not yet. Not yet we don't. Let's be able to rock it, man. Alright, so if we don't gotta do that, we let's go this way. Ah! What is that? 
Oh, he wants to play dodgeball. You're gonna lose. I was very mediocre at dodgeball, everybody. I was great at it. Who's that? Oh! We're in the cold zone! Okay, so cold zone. Blue. Blue on the map. That did some damage to us quickly. You know what the weirdest part about dodgeball was? I always used to hit Justin Sweatland in the nuts. It was never on purpose, but every time I played against him, I hit him in the balls. I didn't even feel like it was on purpose. Well, no. No, we talked about it. <laughs> yeah, the conversation. He didn't really like playing against me. Can you please stop hitting the balls? Me? Yeah, can you please stop hitting me in the test? Well, I think that's exactly what he said to me, too. He was like, can you please stop hitting me in the nuts? And I was like, dude, it's not my fault. I think you might have been. I don't mean to do it. <gasps> oh, we got power up. Look at what! And do what it looks like from Super Metroid! Yeah, that's awesome. Oh! That's awesome. Give me! Charge me required! Alright, now what the fuck does that do? I don't know, but what kind of. Do we have. We I have, thought you were gonna get the ball. I thought I was gonna get the ball too. But y'all, take a charge beam. Do we have cool. Do we have some cool cast and chat thing? I, we, uh, I've changed the, the emotes around. Let's get some hype. Hype. This is one of the default emotes, but it looked really cool, so I put it in there as a tier two. Charge beam! And I have, like, the same music. Yeah. Yeah. Char solid. Focus energy. Focus this beam energy to unleash a powerful shot. Press and hold Y to charge and then release to fire. Charge shots to damage enemies and use normal beam shots, such as robots and bosses. They can also open charge beam doors. In addition, Samus can. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, hold on. Perform I... a charge attack. In addition, Samus can perform a charge attack by spin jumping when the beam is fully charged. Oh, that's pretty sick. I remember that move actually. That's an old school move. I can I can do a so spin those, jump with those, it. Those those blue beams. You remember those blow uh, uh blue barriers that you were talking about? I think that's what you were talking yeah. about. Oh, look at these doors. These doors right here. Oh, those doors. Those doors. Okay. Never mind. And I think that that area, that area right where where it had that that grid the three that yeah. I could charge yeah. I, I could charge beam no, action. You're 100 percent right about charge that, attack yeah. by spin jumping. When the beam. Yeah, so you gotta charge it, and then you gotta spin. There you go. Oh, and look at how kill, fucking that'll kill badass. Enemies. Look at how badass I am. You think so? Yeah. See? <laughs> kill those manta rays easily. Oh, 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 oh. We made our way back to the beginning. Oh, right in the beginning. Oh, we are kicking some ass tonight. So we're in the beginning now for a reason. Probably trying to make you go back to get another. Get the roly poly. Yeah, to get another power. Oh, fuck that guy. This door right here. There you go. Dodgeball butt. Ooh, ha ha. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I really like the, gla uh, like the graphics of this game, like the art style. There Hold on, listen, listen, listen for it, everybody. Oh, it only does that when we get. It only does that when we get, like, power-ups. I guess so. Dude, I don't know. The graphics are awesome. I, I definitely like the art style. I do. Yeah. Not gonna lie. I really want to check out that uh, Ghosts and Goblins game, too. Ghosts and Ghouls, like the remake of the original. Ghost? They made it for the Switch. You're going to have to show me that. Yeah. Ghosts and Goblins is, like, a really old-school, like, Super Nintendo slash Nintendo game. And it's actually like a Halloween game. Kind of like Castlevania. Cast I, dude, I did like Castlevania. Do you remember Arthur? You know, like he had armor and then like if you if you got hurt, you would lose it and he'd be running around in his underwear with throwing knives. I do remember this. That's ghost and that's ghosts and goblins. That is a really fucking tough game. I actually have it on one of my arcade machines. Really? Yeah. That's right. Oopsie has... How many now? 
five right now. I'm planning on getting another one eventually. He's got five classic arcade systems set up. I don't know if I, I don't know which one I want. Uh, yeah, I don't know. If, I, I think I'm gonna go for the Simpsons one. Dude, you gotta let me know when you get that. I also really want the X Men one too. Oh, that's that's a tough one. Yo, chat, what do you think? Do you think he should go Simpsons Arcade or X Men Arcade? Oh, dude, this is this is this. Is. Oh, we oh we're at a save point. Let's do this. Sam Station, yeah. All right, so now we can go through what? Can't go in there yet. Don't lie to me. Absolutely not. Are you bouncing up there? No. Why am I back here? Okay, I clearly went the wrong way. Give me a road soda. Yep. Set station, yay! Okay, so now that we got that, oh wait, this this door, charge beam door, yeah. We gotta get over here. Wait, ooh. Oh, we have markers. Place a marker. We can place a marker. Maybe it's a waypoint to. Like yeah. Oh, so look at the map now, dude. Oh, See the red okay. arrow? Yeah, so it can tell you where you need to go. Oh, uh, that's cool. I like that. Would have been a lot more helpful if we did that earlier in the game. <laughs> it's a good thing they told us how to do that. Pretty sure they didn't. No, I don't think they did at all. Okay, this is it, right here. That is the waypoint. Oh, the waypoint doesn't disappear, though. So you have to manually get rid of it. Yeah, you gotta take it off. Or move it. Move it. X. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, Magsy. X. You shall go through the door to the left. Motherfucker. You need to roll it. You're not gonna be able to get through it anyway. You need to roll it. Yeah, but see, I know. We all know what's on the other side of this door. What's up? A robot, side? dude, that's gonna chase us. Well, that's not. That's. That's. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's gonna happen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, cutscene! 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 Cut that, was, that was a very short cutscene. You didn't skip it, did you? No, I didn't hit anything. I pointed at you! Cutscene! Continued! That must be, like, the Omega robot. Omega. Like, you're gonna die, robot. I'm not gonna die. I'm gonna die! Oh, God, you can't go anywhere now. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> no, listen, don't anybody clip that, alright? Because I realized it just said, I'm not gonna die. And then re immediately sprinted into death. Well, I kind of knew you were gonna die when I saw how quick he came at you. <laughs> and you had nowhere to go. Oh, yeah, that was bad. Like, that was... You couldn't slide back under the same hole, so it's... It was bad. Bad things happen to good people. This fucking thing is looking for us, maybe. Or are we looking for it? I think we should go right this time. I think you, I think you might are be you going the same way? I can't go... How am I going to climb up that? Oh, yeah. Look. Yeah, no, I see it now. You need the circle thingy. You need, you need the sonic. You need the sonic roll. It's called the sonic roll. No. Even though it's not the first, uh, Sonic wasn't the first one to do it. Why don't you go upwards? Where? Yeah, this is where he killed me. Go up, up. You gotta bounce off the wall, probably. He knows we're here. All right, so let him come, and then you jump over him, and you do a sliding thing. He's gonna come down now. Yeah, yeah. So look, you gotta, yeah. There you go. Now do it. Okay, there you go. You 
job. You're a fucking rock star. Say that to everyone. Say that to all the girls, don't you? Only, only, uh, only, only if I can paint you like one of my French girls. <laughs> oh! He's back! You ain't got shit. You a bitch. Yeah, you like that, don't you? We're spanking you. Do we get where we... The hell is that guy? Where are we? Where is this? Sensor locked door. You're in a new area. Uh, it doesn't look new. What's new to me? Uh, your eyes can deceive you. What is that? Uh, you're Should we even be over here? You're a ghost. Yes. What is this? Who cares? Go. Do it. Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. Power beam door. Yeah, go. Do it. Question mark means you haven't been here yet. Told you you weren't. You said it looked familiar. You know, I don't like you yelling at me all the time. That guy's trying to shit on me. Fucking moon. Who's that? <gasps> Miss'll take a quiet, everybody. Now we're getting somewhere. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I really don't like these guys trying to shit on me. Yoda. It's not Yoda, it's Grogu. It's Baby Yoda. It's not Baby Yoda. It, it was Baby Yoda before it was Grogu, okay? You're right. You're right. Ah, fucker. Ow! Ow! I didn't, I didn't fare very well in that. The question is, though, is Grogu Yoda's father? Can you fix him? Is it his father, though? Or is it his grandfather? I don't know if we know yet. That's a good question. I haven't watched the second No, I think it's just the same because they're, they're just the same race, right? Well, I forgot. Is, um... Is it before Star Wars or after Star Wars? Oh my god, look at this. That's pretty sick. Oh shit. You're in a ball game. Oh! I'm... Yeah, I, I, I don't okay, know. we're dying. I don't know if the Mandalorian is after uh, the Star Wars saga or before the Star Wars saga. Uh, I think it's before. So, Roku could be his grandfather or his father. Hold on. We got Grim saying, people can't, nor will they accept the fact that Matthew Litter is not coming back to scream. All right, this has nothing to do with Star Wars. Uh, Grim says, people have it in their heads that his character is coming back to scream. Five, it's not in his uh, filmography. So do your research before assuming things that would make sense. Oh, uh, that. So, Grim, I know you, you said something on. I saw you tweeted something earlier. I, I thought you were referring to um, one of the murderers, which I was like, oh, why would anybody think one of the uh, killers from the original screams would come back to dead? Wait, but, what am I. What, what, what's but that's that's what he is referring to, because Matthew Lillard was the killer in the first one, right? Matthew, one Matthew Lillard and Skeet Ulrich. Mm hmm. Well, I guess uh, he saw some, uh, some shit. So somebody's being stupid? Is that what's going on? Yeah. Oh, he... Oh, so somebody thinks that they're bringing all the original killers back. Yeah. Why would they do that? Well, that's what he's saying. It's like, that's, that's ridiculous. That's the dumbest thing I ever heard. <laughs> Every Scream movie has been a new killer. So why... Like, when you do a... When you do a slasher movie... Why would you bring the original, original killers back? Unless they're like Jason or fucking... Or, uh, or Michael Myers. Like, supernatural. 
I don't think that's the case. has always right. been about, like, um, like, like, most, all the Scream movies have been a tie-in to, somehow, to, uh, Nev Campbell's character, Sidney Prescott, right? Have they all been? Yes, all of them. Where's this? All of them. The first one was her boyfriend. Who Thermal Fuel's flow has been redirected. What do, what do you think that means? Oh, you think the lava rooms are going to be like... Probably. So so the first one was with her boyfriend who uh, found out that her father was sleeping with her mother. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. She was cheating on her father with, with his... with his Or his father was cheating... Whatever. Anyway... So that's how that one, the first one. The second one was about her, uh, what was the second one? I don't even know if I remember the second one. Who was the killer in the second one? Oh, they went to college in the second one, right? And the second one was, um, uh, the second one was Skeet Ulrich's mother. And uh, the guy who played Billy Loomis, or Billy, whatever the hell his name is, Loomis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was Skeet Ulrich's, uh, Billy Loomis's mother, the killer, and it was um, Nikki, who was their friend in college. Whatever. He, he had nothing to do with Sidney Prescott, but he was a psychopath. And then the third one was her brother, her bastard brother. And then, Dude, uh, there's so much of it that I, I gotta go back and watch. And then it. the fourth one was her niece. The fourth one ended up. Being her niece, niece was a killer. Yeah, which was um uh uh what's her name? Uh, is that what? Pretty, wait, pretty, wait. How accurate is it? Because Grim, I know you follow these really. Pretty, pretty woman, uh, uh, actress, um, Julia, Julia Roberts. Emma Roberts, her, her niece, was the killer in the fourth one, and or one of the killers, and uh, she was um, Nef or uh, Sidney Prescott's niece, I think. So you know the fifth one is going to be something that's tied into her, because every single one has been tied to her. It's always one killer that's not tied to her at all. It's just some random psychopath. And then the other killer is always somebody that's part of her family. Grim, tell me if I'm wrong. <laughs> I dare you. It needs to know. No, Matt needs to know. What? He doesn't want me to be right. What? What? Okay, this is the sensitive, right? Where is... No, I'm a movie guy. You can't fuck with me on that. I might be able to. Okay, we can't... We can't get in that door. Come in here with shoes. There's <laughs> a little fuck in my shoes. <laughs> where, oh, where am I going, please? This game's confused me. Oh, wait, what, what is this all about? Talk to me, uh, big... Uploading data. There is no record of your assailant in the Federation database. However, there are records of intros of Warrior Tribe. There is a strong possibility that you are connected. You have seen the Warrior Tribe's architecture and artifacts on this planet. I conclude that this was one of their settlements. But why would someone lead you here? 
here and send the enemy after you. The footage of the ex parasite may have been staged to lure you in. Interesting. Very interesting. The situation remains unclear, but your priority hasn't changed. You must return to the ship. You have activated the magnet supply system that has restored power to the closed thermal doors. Seek the bug to proceed. You have activated the supply system to power to close thermal doors. Continue to search for the unique energy you employed against the first enemy. It is the only way you can confront them. Unfortunately, Shit. this energy is limited. You may have noticed it dissipating after an enemy is destroyed. There are six remaining enemy hunting you. You have no means to confront them. Yeah, I remember that, Mr. Robot. Found my shoes. You got your shoes? That's good. Good for you. Why are my shoes off? I didn't even know set them up. We're happy you found your shoes. Was I right, though? About what? About the whole <sighs> scream uh, plot. I think Grim might be looking it up right oh, now. Okay. Ammo recharge. What the fuck is this? Energy recharge. Where's this? This is the charge beam. Power beam door. Oh, this is like the frost section, right? Charge me up! Let's see. See, oops, she understands. I mean, I know Hollywood can do anything nowadays, but this is ridiculous. Yeah. Billy and Stu scream one. Mickey and Billy's mom scream two. Uh, Roman scream three. And Jill and Charlie scream four. Emma Roberts and Roy Cole. Okay. I'll let him know that as soon as he comes back. Grim. Thank you for looking, uh, thank you for, uh, throwing that in there for us. Oh, shit! I'm fucking dead. I'm dead again. I'm dead again. Son of a bitch. Down, 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 down. Yo, you guys ready for Pops Playoff Picks this Thursday? I am super excited for that. We are going to have some fun. It's going to be tough. There are going to be some tough picks this Thursday. I'm telling you. I know you're sitting there and you're thinking about everybody in the playoffs right now. Pops and I were talking about it as we were walking the poopster around. Um, it's not going to be easy. Not going to be easy pickings. Son of a bitch. We're in trouble. We're in this. Uh, okay. Oh, so Grim did write in to confirm what you were saying. Let's pause this really quick. He says, see, oopsie understands. I mean, I know Hollywood could do anything nowadays, but this is ridiculous. And yeah. Billy and Stu scream one. Mickey and Billy's mom scream two. Roman scream three. And Jill and Charlie and scream four. Emma Roberts and Rory Culkin. Yeah, so. Yeah, I know those movies. You were right. I want to get out of this area. Like, the, the, the fact that they don't, the fact that they make a movie, if they make the new one based on somebody that isn't related to her, I will be surprised. Yeah. Or has some tie-in to a relation to her. Like, and I also heard the new movie, like, I'm excited to see the new Scream movie, right? I am. I'm pumped. I'm excited to see it. But I also heard that the movie, uh... Is very self-aware. It makes fun of itself. So I'm, I'm, I'm kind of excited to see what they're gonna do. 
but I, I can't, I don't know, man. They literally tied it into her every single time, so I, it'd be, I'd be surprised to see if they don't actually tie it, tie it into her this time. I'm doing this right. But see, like, when I do that... What about rockets? That's what I'm hitting. There we go. Yeah. Oh, he's oh, a brain! God, he's got a brain. And he's a... And you're almost going to die. No, no, we're good. Shoot him in the... Shoot him in the eye. Shoot him in that face. Don't make me nervous. It's like random though. Cause like it'll give me rockets. Just trying to gain a bit of just farming for some extra health right now. Yeah, you're good. Oh. There we go. You dead! You dead bo Sticky thing in his pocket. <laughs> oh he's coming! She was just like, let me touch this. The energy beam from Sinjin to transform the arm can. We have an Omega Cannon, so we could kill that dude. Yeah, but she was like, let me touch this. I didn't even explain how to do fucking. <laughs> well, let me. Uh, you know what? Let's get back into this a second. I'll be right back. I'm just going to use the bathroom real quick. Oh, see, okay. Uh, Matt confused me. So, okay, so you got annoyed that Matthew Lillard is not coming back. Why would he come back? He's dead. Makes no sense. Ah! I agree with you on that one. What happened? What I miss? No, 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 because you confused me with what, what he said the first time. Cause I, so he was talking about Matthew Lillard, how he's not coming back to scream. And I was like, yeah, why would he come back to scream? He's fucking dead. Yeah. But so, that's what people are saying. That like. makes no fucking sense. Why, yeah. How are they going to bring him back? Like, he's literally... He died. You got, yeah, you saw him die. You saw him die. Okay. Yeah, I see I see what you're saying on that one. Yeah, I, I completely agree with you. People are stupid. <laughs> some people just... You know, well, listen, but some people just think some crazy shit's going to happen, right? Yeah, I mean, unless they were making, like, a spoof screen movie where it was very self-aware and they're like, let's bring all the original characters back. Like, that would be, I, I mean, it'd be interesting to see, 
but I can't, like, why would you do that? Like, you're ruining the screen legacy, you know? So it's kind of like, why would you bring, it, it, then the movie shouldn't be canon at all if you're going to bring back all the original characters. It should be like, uh, it should be like, um, what is it? A New Nightmare. Like, uh, with, um, Freddy Krueger. Where, where, like, it was literally set in a movie. Like, that was literally the movie. It was, it was a movie about making the movies and then it becoming a reality. Like, that's the only thing I could see them doing with a Scream movie. Is but we have, we have a great movie here. It's not to cut you off, but he said exactly oopsie. Laugh my fucking ass off. Yeah. I can't stand this bullshit. Yeah, but, but that's the only way I can see them doing that, bringing all the original characters back, like all the, all the, all the, uh, the killers, is literally making a self-aware movie where you're breaking the fifth wall, which is literally what they did with A New Nightmare for, for uh, Freddy Krueger is they literally brought all the original cast back and it was based on a movie and then Freddy Krueger became a reality in their reality. So that, that's the only way I can see them doing that. Which, it wouldn't surprise me because it's a Wes Craven movie but Wes Craven's not alive anymore so I, I don't really know. That's right, yeah. I got, I'm just focusing right now because I know this guy could take me out. What? I hit him! I killed him. I hit him! You died like ten times now? To those things? Yeah. I'd say five. At least six, maybe. I'll say seven. I get this stuff. I get this. The bean cannon. Have a little faith in me. I didn't do it right. I gotta hit it up, dude. There's three button things you gotta do to pull that off. And I, I just, I just let go of everything. You make my nose shiny. What does that even mean? I have no idea. I just felt like so. Well, we had time last. All right, we still got about half an hour of this left. Have a little faith in Oh, I gotta stop letting go of the fucking button. We're gonna kill this guy right here. Watch it. Watch it happen now. Come on over, buddy. Uh oh, I, I, I did it again. I did it again! I'm gonna go to fucking Martin do! Because, like, I let. Because you hold this to aim, you hold this to charge, and then you gotta hit this to shoot. But I keep thinking as soon as I let go of the button, it's gonna shoot. Grim, clip his anger, please. Don't do any of that. Don't clip, listen to him. Clip his anger. He's not in control of the channel. Clip his anger. I, I feel like sometimes I'm not either, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. I'm gonna kill this thing. Don't let go of the button. Don't let go of the button. Don't let go of the button. Kill yeah, you gotta shoot him in his red fucking face. You don't you gotta, like, wait for the thing to open? Is that what you gotta do? Yeah. I think I might just run from him. Did you just... Did you read what it says? No. Why don't you read what it says? That would make sense. <laughs> Damn it. Grim clipped it. Grim clipped it. <laughs> Why 
why you gotta do me like that, dude? Sometimes we have to have a little laugh here. Right? He won't die! Oh, dude, 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 you're doing this wrong. You're doing this wrong. He has to open his face plate on his on his head. You can't hit him right now. You have to run from him until he opens. Until his he face. opens his face plate. Yo, his face plate is stupid. <laughs> You know what? I don't like his face plate. I don't like his face plate. It's kind of pissing me off, dude. It's, it's, it's so dumb. He's, he's got a, his face was up here. No, that's where he's going to come from. Yeah. He thinks he's so cute. Oh, no. It's like underneath. I know, but where is he? Get away from the car. I don't want to slide into him. I did that one time already. Can you give me a road soap? Yeah. She just thinks she's so damn funny because she's going to tell people the clip stuff. <laughs> Come on, it was kind of funny. This guy over here, just see, she's a regular freaking ha ha ha. I mean, we know you weren't really angry, but still, it was kind of funny. Ha 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 ha! It's still kind of funny. Oh! Where do we go? We're going to die. Oh, he's coming. So wait, what do I do? Oh, do I gotta shoot at him with the thing? Yeah, you gotta keep shooting. Just, uh, just, uh, well, no, I don't mean like that. You should shoot, shoot him now. That red thing, shoot him. When it when it turns red like that, it, you see how he opened up and he turned red like that? You gotta shoot him when he's... When no, he's... you see, I blew his face thing off. Oh, okay, cool. I'll try it. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah, let's go! go! So you gotta do the, the brrrr and so you blow his face. burst fire, yeah, okay. Burst right. fire his face off. All right. You gotta bur burst fire your face off. Let's go. Is it me or did they not explain? They didn't really explain that, did they? They didn't explain it. That's how we took they care of that. They said just shoot him with the cannon. That's literally what it said, just shoot him with the cannon. We got a spider magnet. I don't know what that is. I don't know either. Maybe they'll explain that. Probably not. Allow Samus to attach to blue magnetic surface walls and seal his using. Look at okay. us. Now you're a fucking Spider-Man. <laughs> you're a Spider-Man. Certain walls and seals to grab on. Dude, by the way, I know I said this. I said it. I tweeted about it. I said it. I, get, I said it. I say it again. Spider-Man No Way Home. Yeah, I gotta That shit was this. amazing. Check that shit watch out. The shit. I also gotta watch the Venom. Uh, Car Car no Let there be carnage? Me. Yeah, I, I gotta see that. I heard it was amazing. Yeah, I enjoyed it. <laughs> Samus I, can move and attack while on his stay while up. I like the first one. Attached to a ceiling to press against And him. you know what I heard? I heard that the next Spider Man is going to be Venom. Is going to be in the new Spider Man movie. We, well, way home. it'll be interesting to see how they go about it. Depleted, make it, make the cannons offline. Look at all this green! We don't have to worry about this fucking guy anymore. Well, for now. You have to worry about him for now. No, he's dead. You gotta kill him in the other areas, though. Yeah, in the other areas, but this... Yeah, this house is cleared. That's true. What in God's... Target? We did things. We did things and stuff, people. Can you believe it? They said it couldn't be done. What's up with that shit? Nothing. Oh, oh yeah! You're gonna put little jelly butt, little jelly, little, little jelly butt. Hey, 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 hey! Where the fuck you going? I ain't done with you. Nice. That's weird. Oh! Hey, Grim. Who do you think's making the Super Bowl, man? Oh, I gotta go the other way. Super Bowl! It's right around the corner, everybody. Curious about your opinion. Who do you think is going to make the Super Bowl? I'm not sure about the other team, but I'm pretty sure Green Bay is going to make it. 
You thinking Green Bay? I'm thinking Green Bay, man. I I said that months ago. Maybe not months ago, but like maybe two or three streams ago when with you and Manny when I was actually in it. I think I I, I said it was gonna be Green Bay. Yo, we got Wild Man Dave in the chat saying, "Hey, Wiz, I got a joke. What do you got, Wild Man? How you doing, bro?" How is it going? What's the joke, man? What's the joke, man? What is this? Hey, where did you come from? Oh, that's where he came from. Where am I going? Oh, oh. You see that guy? That guy tried being cute. He's trying to be cute. Ah, you're dead. Blew your ass off, too. See, Grim said, yeah, I put my money. He's putting his money on Green Bay. Look at this shit. Uh-oh. Controller get disconnected. Selling off the That was rather conserving. It's so weird how it does that sometimes. Oh no, it's not dying, is it? I think it is actually. Hold on a second. We can fix this problem. I have the other one set up just in case. Cool. Just in case. Let me ask this. How funny do you all like your humor? I mean, we got pretty dirty fucking minds, so... It all depends on Matt's rules as far as it goes to chat. So if you think it can, uh, it can get through the rules, then go ahead and say it. Oh! We're going with, listen, as long as it doesn't have to do with, uh, right? Well, what are the rules? Religion, politics, shit like that? Or race. Race. Dude, it feels so weird holding this controller right now. How bad are we talking, wild man? Where do I gotta go? How do I get out of here? It's none of that. It's just edgy. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's oh, see so it's like dark humor. He's saying it's dark humor. Okay, he'll send it through Discord just okay. to be on the same. Oh, I appreciate that, yeah, dude. Yeah, it's probably dark humor. Probably has something to do with uh, how much you want to make a bet has to do with uh, uh, Bob Saget. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> you know what? That's a good point. That's a yeah. What is this fucking thing? All right, he just sent it. Uh, I'm not on your Discord, so I don't... Yeah. Hold on. I'll pull it up. Real quick. Let's see, let's see. Check the Discord real quick. Check in. Check, 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 check in. Hold on, where is it? Oh, here he is. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it out loud. Just, just read it to yourself. <laughs> yeah, you were right. It's fucking dark. It's fucking dark, dude. <laughs> okay, it's a good thing you didn't say that on stream. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one. That was a good that was one, good, bro, though. man. That was funny. Oh, you got a sick sense of humor, bro. <laughs> what does it say about me? I'm fucking laughing at it. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Where? Oh, Grim says, where is it? I can't find it. Um, Gr Wow, man, you want to post it in the uh, in the general? Uh, the general part of my Discord? This is where Grim can see it. Ah. Uh. 
Or you could even send it to Grim. Because Grim's on Discord, too. Yeah, however you want to do that. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, where are we at? Let's find a save station. That's what we need to do right now. Can't get out of here. They want us to do this. Oh. Dude, I'm enjoying it. I like like watching it. I'm enjoying this game. I definitely gotta buy this. Yeah. Oh, we gotta Oh. We were already we already did this. Do we have to go back? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, good, good, good. Yeah, send, send that to Grim. Grim, Grim, you get a kick out of it. It's fucking. <laughs> All right, how do we get the f out of here? How did we get in here? Where do I gotta go? Where do I gotta go? Okay, I'm here. We gotta get up. So that was the boss fight. I think he's silent ghost wild, man. I think. Right, Grim? We have to use the magnetic thing. I'm just gonna name it. Yeah, there you go. Okay, okay, I think I know where I'm going now. Oh. How do I get through this door? It's a sealed door. How do, you get through, how do you get through the sealed door? I, I, I don't understand. I want, I want out. get up there. Missing something. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wild man says he sent another one. <laughs> Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's check the Discord out real quick. Jokes. 
Slot right here, right here. Start it there. <laughs> Yo, wow, man. You know, you know, it's it it it, it, it got to that when when he when he does when Oopsie does that. That's dark. Yeah, I appreciate you though putting that in the Discord while wow, man. But not the chat. I appreciate that, brother. Okay, so I'm stuck right now. I know this is until tomorrow. Thursday? Thursday. Hurry up when day it is. But I'm gonna make my prediction before everybody else. You should wait till Thursday. Well, when we got the board up. No, I want you to know what it is now. You go to change your mind. I'm going to say Green Bay Packers and Kansas City. That's what you think the Super Bowl is going to be? Yep. I think it's going to be KC and I think it's going to be Packers. Okay. Wild man say Bills all the way. You know what? I hope it is the Bills, dude. I I I love the Bills, but I'll, I'll straight up tell you right now. I think it's gonna be I think it's gonna be Green Bay and I think it's gonna be KC. How do I get up there? Have I missed something? Ah, shit. I fell down again. That takes us in for the boss fight. I'm having a hard time here. Same spot. Yeah, I'm, I just said I'm having a hard time here. You want to help me out here? I mean, I don't exactly know what you're looking for. We're trying to get out of this boss fight section. We, okay. we, we've been trapped in this general area for uh, a good minute now. I would now. say go right. Because everything that's green, it stops on the right side. So go right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, so the, here's where the sealed door is. Yeah, so you want to go right. Do we? Yeah. To this door? Or the door. Oh, door. God. Thank you, Oopsie. Thank you. I was so fucking lost there for a minute. I was having a hard time. I was lost in my own way. We got to find a... Sa oh, save station right here. Let's fucking go, yo. I hope it's Bills all the way as well, man. I mean, I really don't want... I wouldn't mind seeing Green Bay in the Super Bowl. I think it would make for a good Super Bowl. I'm not going to lie. I don't but really want to see Green the... Bay. I don't really want to see Green Bay in the Super Bowl again. I've seen them in the fucking Super Bowl so many times. No, what are you talking about? When was the last time you saw them in the Super Bowl? 90s. I know Aaron Rodgers made it once, right? Doesn't he yeah. have a ring? Aaron Rodgers. So, so, was, okay, but he's 90s. not, no, if anybody's, if anybody was in it all the time, it was like New England. Yeah, that's true. I definitely don't want to see them in it again. I'll tell you that much. All right, let's be fair. Let's be fair. Green Bay hasn't been in it in like a decade. Well, it has been about a decade. It has been about all right. a decade. All right, maybe more. But they've been, they've been in, they've been in there probably, what, about three times? I think it was about three times. That's a good question. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that, but um, I'm I pretty. I feel like Green Bay was always the uh, the top choice team, especially in the '90s. And uh, I did not. I was not a Green Bay fan. I uh, I definitely think Green Bay is gonna make it in with Kansas City. I would love to see the Bills. I would absolutely love to. See I can't the Bills. remember the last time I saw the Bills in a play, in a Super Bowl. Uh, the I think it's because we weren't even alive. Yeah, so I would love to see that as well, especially 
Like, you know, for my sister and her husband and their family. Like, you know, I know the kids are Bills fans. Like, rooting. We got the one New York team in the playoffs right now. Let's go. And Grim over here saying Packers all the way. Uh, the record kicks ass 13-4. and four. Yo, Green fucking Bay. Yeah, it's, I get it so crazy. Grim there's, hearing you say that because you're a Vikings there's fan. There's such good teams, though, man. They're all so there really fucking is. close. This is a loaded it's playoffs. It's a really hard thing. It's a loaded playoffs. It's a really hard thing to predict. Dude. And to be honest, Aaron Rodgers, not really the guy that I thought he was. I mean, he's old now. He's a, yeah, but you know what, dude? Like he just said, though, 13 and 4. True, but. they He lost the first game. And he got blown out in the first game of the season. And then from there, never looked back and just started beating the shit out of everybody. Yeah, and yeah, but then you also got, you know, yeah, I guess. I, I you know, Think about I, that. Think I, about I, that. I guess, but it's like, I don't know. I always look, look at fucking Brady's 44 and he's back in the playoffs. Well, Brady's, oh, Brady's the greatest of all time. A, but again, Aaron Rodgers could be up there. Ar Even though I don't care for Aaron Rodgers, he could be up there. Too. Arguably, Brady is probably the best quarterback that's ever lived. So it, it's, you know. But we're just saying again is yes, this this playoffs. It's a loaded playoffs. It is a loaded playoffs. It's going to be exciting. We've got amazing fucking teams going against each other right now. It's 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 hard to. It's hard to determine who's going to be in there, but I honestly think it's going to be Green Bay and Kansas City. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is that possible, though? Yeah. Because uh, are they? Because if it's right, it's got to be AFC. Yeah. AFC, AFC, American football versus national football. Yeah. Kansas City is not NFL, right? Well, not. Uh, well, it's got to be American versus national. Yeah, and I think KS. I, I think uh, Kansas City is. I think Green City Bay is. is is Green Bay is um, American, and Kansas City is, is national. Is national. Is that is that correct? I'm pretty sure. I just wish the Bills don't fuck up, y'all. I, I want to see the Bills. You know what? They did great last season, Wild Men. Uh, you know they just had they had a rough game against KC. All right. Yeah. But uh, you know what? They, again, they're a team. They, they're a solid team. They're back in the playoffs again. It's anybody's game right now. It's anybody's playoffs. You yeah. just get a little bit of luck and just everything, you know, all those things that got to go go right for you, right? Yeah. And uh, you know what, though? Sunday, man. We're going to be getting into this more on Thursday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, we're going to be talking uh, playoffs, and we're going to do Pops picks. We're going to go over the regular season Pops picks. And then, uh, you know, we're going to clean slate it and see how everybody does during the playoffs. It's going to be exciting. And we have games. We're going to mention it again on Thursday nights. But there's going to be playoff games on Saturday. And there's going to be playoff games on Sunday. This is a very exciting weekend. And uh, before we get off, I'd like to thank Oopsie for hanging out there in the stream, chilling out on the couch, helping me out. We've been enjoying Metroid Dr uh, Dread together. Yeah. Right? Great having game. some having some fucking beer beans with us, it's you know? Great game, man. So, uh, again, cheers to that, dude. I gotta pick this shit up. <laughs> yeah, dude. This is something I feel like you, yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll never see him again. I, do, I know it's the gaming streaming night, but I, I had to bring up football because it's coming up. No, we so. talk we talk so much. Even on the even on the sports night, we talk yeah. movies and shit, so it's all good. I mean, I may or may not be on Thursday, so. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see if he's still hanging out, you know. We'll, uh, we'll make sure to clear uh, the couch and have... Special guest Oopsie bag, not only for the gaming stream tonight, maybe we'll see him again on Thursday. I couldn't take the king's seat tonight. Well, that's all I got to say. Yeah. I had to sit on the couch. I've <laughs> shown respect to Papa K. I like it. I like it. Let's see. We got Grim over here real quick saying they'd be 14-3, and three and uh, they not lost Sunday's game, but regardless, they're, be they're beating ass. Without a doubt, Green Bay is going to be a team to look out for. Again, very loaded weekend. It's going to be real exciting. But uh, I think uh, you got anything you want to add, Oopsie? Uh, honestly, I like I said, I called uh, Green Bay and um, Kansas City, but I honestly think Kansas City's going to win. You think they're going to win another Super Bowl? Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. I honestly, I honestly do. Uh, defense wins mm -hmm. games, man. 
Well, if you want to see what my picks are going to be like, you're going to have to wait till Thursday because I ain't revealing shit right now. But oh my god! You guys should definitely pick up, uh, if you have a Switch, you should definitely pick up Dread. I'll tell you that much. Dude, yeah. Awesome game. This is awesome right now. And we will. I will be getting back into Batman Arkham Origins at some point, but I just needed a break from it for a little bit. All the games kind of feeling the same to me. Too much Batman. Too much Batman, and this is a nice, nice fresh breath of fresh breath of air of freshness. If I gotta see Jim Gordon's face one more time, I'm gonna punch it. Ah! But yo, we will see you Thursday night. Possibly Oopsie will be hanging out on the couch, and you know, chilling with us, with me and Papa K. Uh, take it easy, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your week. We'll see you Thursday. See you later, meow. Later, guys. Yo, JD, thank you for stopping by. And again, real quick, thank you everybody for hanging out tonight. Uh, you know, Grim, JD, Wildman, Kylo Ren, thank you for stopping in. I hope you guys, yo, stay warm, man. Stay warm. <laughs>